Alright, cool. So, uh, this is a special episode. We're actually recording this not live. <laughs> so, we both have jobs and we are actually... We, we don't know what happens in uh, the Game Awards. I'm actually quite excited. Are you excited, Mike? I am excited. Absolutely excited. Do I look excited? I'm excited. No, you don't. Okay, fair <laughs> enough. I haven't had enough sleep. No, and the whole excited. job thing, you know. <laughs> and uh, so we should also call out that Swinney isn't here. He's, uh, what, do you know the reason why he didn't come? No, not really. Why? It's just too weak. Oh, of course. <laughs> he was probably worried that they weren't going to make any Halo announcements. And he just couldn't, couldn't deal with that. Well, I actually had my phone. I had to put it all on silent. And then, um, what else did I do? I put it on silent. I put all the notifications on show nothing. Yeah. And then, uh, what was it? I then just had to avoid things. And if I had to look at something that potentially had anything in it, because my phone was mm -hmm. going crazy today. It was going crazy. Like so many notifications. Direct what, messages people... on Twitter. Oh. Um, yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, I don't know what happens okay, today. Wow, Mr. Popular. Um, worst, worst day for that, I think. <laughs> you know, it's probably going to be no announcements. But yeah, Swinny did say, Oh, you look at that. You representing uh, PlayStation. I've got like. I am own. representing PlayStation. I got yeah. my, like, um, we're not in any way, shape, or form sponsored by them, though, obviously. No, we'd be happy I to just happen to have this hat, this <laughs> snazzy looking hat to keep my long flocks it's nice. in I like place. It. We've Thanks. got Nintendo and. We just need Xbox. What? I got my Xbox games behind me. <laughs> nice. I can't actually see you in this, by the way. Which no, that's, that's what we want. <laughs> well, yeah. Well, how am I supposed to react to your reaction? <laughs> you can hear my vocal reaction. Wait, I can hide my hat with another hat. Is that cyberpunk? Yeah. It's cyberpunk, yeah. Oh, yeah, sick. I have a hat on a hat. We we'll have to cover it in the main show on Sunday, but uh, I'm excited yes. to hear yeah. what you think of it. <laughs> We will cover the 95% <laughs> of the time I spent trying to get it to run properly and the 5% I actually spent playing. Well, yeah, I know. We, we, yeah, let's, let's not cover it. I really no, yeah, we won't. got a lot to say. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so the other one is I think Swinney didn't want to watch this because he felt it was going to take... Is that going to stuff up the mic? <laughs> uh, it's not going to stuff up the mic because okay. it's, it's not on the part that you can, you, you can actually... The capsule? Yeah, it's not on the capsule, right? So, uh, that looks kind of sick, actually. I like it. Yeah, I like that, the that looks cool. I like it. Um, okay, I'll keep that. He I'll also advertise said, Cyberpunk as well. <laughs> he also said that he didn't want to do it because he's like, oh, it's going to be like a three and a half hour show. And I was Weak. like, come off it. It's going to be like, they're going to have an edited version. It's going to be like an hour, an hour and a half. And I think mm. we're, we're going to, sure. we're watching <laughs> a three hour version now. Yep. It's, it's quite mad. So, uh, I do have on the display, I've got like our How predictions much? as well. Yeah. Oh, so, the predictions. Yes. Yes. I have to say, my predictions were a bit insane. Well, I don't know if they were insane. You know, you always make calculated predictions. Well, so I've already got half of one of the predictions. So Nintendo, prior, like uh, hours before the Game Awards, said that there's going to mm. be a new Smash Brothers character. Yeah, I did see that. So I, I take well, that as half a point. See, That's I, half a point. Unlike you, so I right. didn't actually look at any notifications. You said you weren't going to look at anything. No, no, but, I stopped at know. about 10 a.m. Australian Eastern okay, Standard Daylight Time. Okay, fair enough. I mean, let me check when he sent me that message, actually. It would have been 10 a.m., I reckon. Uh, yeah, it was like 10.01. Yeah. So, someone's that, full that of was shit. The, that was the end of it. That was the end of it. You know, Fair it's enough. quite sad, but I was, <laughs> I was actually getting really excited <laughs> about, like, watching oh, this. Really? <laughs> yeah. Wow, dude. I don't know. It's just because, like, it's becoming, to me, like, the biggest gaming event for the year. Well, I, I guess it is technically in a way the biggest, uh, unless, you know, it's a re reveal or a big game that comes out like Cyberpunk. Yeah, but dude, they've, they've announced the console on it now. They had like Elden Ring. Yeah, point, like there's a lot of point. big things. Like the oh, yeah, first yeah. DLC character for Smash. It's massive, yeah. It's like, I think everyone's sort of going, oh, let's save our best stuff for, the, for it now. So I, 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 I feel like we should start, have started right? this countdown. 10 seconds? <laughs> no, yeah, I've nine, got eight. like, no, no, no. I've got 16. 15. 16. How do you have 16 seconds <laughs> pause left? It for, pause your thing for a second. Uh, okay, tell me when you're on four seconds. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are you on four? Right. No, six, five, four. All right, three. it's, it's okay. going. It's let's going. Go. Let's go. I'm what, my internet runs faster than yours? <laughs> Probably. <sighs> Offensive. Yeah, I don't know if I can watch this. I'm sorry. I'm off. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this breaks our swearing policy on the show.
Why? We didn't swear. No, if they swear. What's oh. up, everyone? Sydney Good Fair enough. here, coming to you live I've never actually watched the whole thing. Have you ever watched the Neither. whole thing? Neither. No. I don't really care. I just and care about the snippets. I know, <laughs> same. For setting down Cyberpunk for a few Is this hours. chick from IGN? As you can probably yeah. tell, the Game Awards are going to look a little different this year. Our venue may be smaller, but the show itself is as gigantic as ever. The awards and world premieres won't be changing, except I guess the only people clapping like, will be me. Normally, I just put this in two times speed. I'll just skip. This year will bring <laughs> exactly. us musical performances from just London like and Tokyo. Over. And yeah. one positive of tonight's mostly digital gathering is we'll get to see more faces in the talented teams behind this year's outstanding <laughs> nominated oh, games. Oh, yeah, because everyone's working from home. As for us, here in the pre-show, we'll yeah. be spending the remaining minutes no, before don't the look. awards kick don't off look. with brand new trailers. <laughs> yeah, ruin it. Waited all day to watch marketing, it. And Lynn will be performing a song marketing. from Persona 5 Strikers. Ooh. And best Sounds of all, fun. the big reason we're all here, awards. The world premiere Our first is category on. tonight is best score in music. Oh, it's hey, we got this. So I said Doom, you said uh, Ori, and uh, no, you said Last of Us, and I said, said Ori. Yeah. 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 Let's generation. see who's winning. Okay, Here come are on. The nominees come on, Jones. Wow, they, they get Eternal. straight into it. That's awesome. Final Fantasy VII Here we go, boys. Hades. Ori and the Will of the Wisps. And Ooh. The Last I'm just of Us kidding. Part two. Here we go. Who's winner? The winner is... I've got zero dollars riding on this. Final Fantasy VII Remake. <laughs> wow. We're all, <laughs> totally wrong. <laughs> what was it? Five choices. <laughs> yeah. And, and we, we all got we all we all wrong. Different one. I reckon they deserve it, though. From what I played, it was really? an amazing... Oh, yeah. Like, I mean, Final Fantasy VII music is some of my favorite music of all time. So this revamped version of it was really, really good. But I'm surprised. I don't know. I thought because it's also journalists voting for it. I just earlier, wouldn't think you'll be Final Fantasy VII remake. Different uh. world premieres throughout this pre-show. I thought yours was not bad. Strangely enough, we've decided to show you our most important one first. Here it is. What is this? I don't know. It's, it's so hard to listen to you. Think <laughs> okay, about I'll that and up. listen to what she's saying as well. <laughs> uh, now you keep digital. talking. It's fine. Sponsored by Devolver Digital. And this is funny. Hey, Devolver Digital. Host, Devolver Digital. The game of the year. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be mad, and then we could just like go. Okay, all right, so yeah. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Shush it. So yeah, tonight we are here to she celebrate has got this six year's most memorable haircut. video oh, no. games. How much do they pay this lady? Not for hype. Not for this. But for lot, next year, probably. as yet now, to yeah. be released, games come in at you hot from what many believe to be this industry's most ridiculously overrated publisher. While most Ladies of these awful. games are months away from release, we at Devolver Digital yeah, are strong actress. proponents of awards. <laughs> For awards sake and with that the nominees for the devolver digital 2021 game of the year are shadow warrior 3 <laughs> by flying wild <laughs> olea by skeleton this is so Olya. odd hey this looks cool i haven't actually seen that Nereal. weird west by wolf i like how the guys are clapping it's quite funny yeah we should do the clapping as well Loop Hero by developer Four Quarters. <laughs> that was. A, <laughs> I love the reaction there. Four Quarters couldn't be here with us this evening as Loop Hero was unannounced until, well, just now, really. Let's have a look at Loop Hero. This is cool. Please enchant it. I love how old school this looks, man. This looks super old school, though. Summon monsters, build cathedrals, and remember your world. Scrounge for weapons, armor, and mystical items to level up. I still love chip tunes, man. Oh yeah, yeah. Customize your card. Sometimes I just put them on Spotify, just chill out. Yeah, I'm actually thinking of um redoing our intro music in chip oh in chip tune that'd be awesome i've got what do i have i've got um the rolly blocks oh hey i gotta pull out of the uh, box we'll see you next year whatever laters i always like to pause oh, and read that oh, stuff Neil. Oh, awesome glad they uh they got the do our best to highlight new games from all sorts of developers from triple a big shots like developers i wonder if this is best indie game independent studios our next oh. world premiere is the debut yeah, 
of a new said. game from Awasan, no. a young studio started in New Caledonia. Enjoy. New Caledonia, wow, French game. Wow. Man, I don't even remember any of my predictions, so everything's just going to go Your predictions, like, wow. Switch Pro. <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> God of War Ragnarok and okay. Xbox VR AR set. Okay, cool. Like a mixed reality. Okay, this is looking really cool so far. That's cool for an indie game. I feel like so many of these like, games are inspired by Breath of the Wild now. Oh yeah, I was going to say exactly that. There is another game that's out at the moment, I forget the name of it, that Phoenix is very... Immortals is, Rising. Is that one? Yeah, it used to be called Gods and Monsters. Okay. Or are you talking about Gen Genshin Impact? No, I don't know. It's, I th thought it was by an Australian developer. Or maybe I'm way off. There's only two that are really like very obvious Breath of the Wild inspired, let's just say. Mm, so that's, um, I forget the name. Phoenix Rising. Phoenix Immortals Rising or Phoenix Rising Immortals. It's I don't really think weird it name. was that. Well, then it's uh, Gen Genshin, Gen Genshin Impact. It's, on, look it's it from Chinese oh. developer. Okay, that's an interesting mechanic. Huh. It so you looks can take cool. I like the art. It's yeah. like Pixar or something. A Lilo and Stitch, kind of. See, it's French. I actually commend them for actually just having it in French. Ooh, the eye. Did you see the eye? I don't think that was French. No, yeah, it's not French. <laughs> it's some indigenous <laughs> language. That's crazy. Game inspired by New Caledonia. That's pretty cool. That is really cool, yeah. Wait, inspired by it? the developer are actually from there. Well, they're from this there, but then the, cool. the game is itself is inspired. Most popular genres, action adventure. Oh, we've got okay. this one. So, Swinny and I said yep. Last of Us Part Two, and you said Ghost. Being one of our Ooh, most competitive okay. categories. Incidentally, for the past three years, the Game Award winner for action adventure has gone on to win. That's going to be Last of Us Part Two, so boy. This is a big one. Here are the nominees for best action adventure. <laughs> you can't you see me hollering. Assassin's Creed <laughs> yeah, I can't. It's annoying. I can't see anything. <laughs> you can watch the whole thing later. Come on, ghost. Yeah, I'll watch the whole retrospective. Of the retrospective that's already late. And The Last of Us Part right. 2. Okay. I've got my winner button. Is... Here we go. The Last of Us Part 2. Yes! Oh, nice. Nice. I mean, well deserved. Well deserved. We that means that we're going to win the whole thing. Us as the best action adventure game. Hey, I could still come uh, back from this. On behalf of the directors, which is myself, Anthony Newman, and Neil Druckmann, uh, we want to thank the entire team at Naughty Dog who poured their heart and soul. See, they're not even putting their game. big guys out yet. Their talent that because they know they're going <laughs> to win the big <laughs> ones. You feel like you're on this journey with Ellie. Uh, want to thank Evan Wells, our president. I still can't believe I got uh, that game for like $23 Australian. Really yeah, because it was 29 That's and then crazy. he got a discount on it, right? Yeah, like, so I signed up to the JB Hi-Fi newsletter with a fake email and, and got another 5% off. Make this game <laughs> wow. Special. And I got, uh, so, but that's 5% off clean on the 15% off discount. Yeah, yeah, because so they had more than double, 20 off. So it was a double discount, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> and it was super cheap to begin with. It was 29 Australian dollars. Full freight. It's crazy. Here's another trailer. And Demon Souls is still 109 bucks. I, dude, I almost pulled the trigger on a uh, PS5. I'm but I'm like, the games are so expensive. Where did they have them? Oh, I've got my sources. Oh, you have your sources. Like what? <laughs> now they pop in and out of availability on some of the sites for that people don't realize. Okay. Oh, she's speaking English. Sea of Solitude. I'm very German happy English. to announce that Sea of Solitude will be coming to Nintendo Switch this winter. <gasps> but cool. it's not just a port. We fully reworked the entire game. We're calling it the Director's Cup because it's a version that truly represents what I If there wasn't was subtitles, I would be able to understand it. That are as what do you mean? She <laughs> speaks perfectly fine. No, that's what I'm saying. I feel like the subtitles are a bit insulting. They're unnecessary, yeah. Um, yeah. It's like but I guess not everyone can kind of pick up some of the... the but you know when they put subtitles on Australians? On TV yeah, that's the best. <laughs> I think they need to put subtitles on me because some of the way I pronounce words. No, but that's just. I have you know, no idea how you guys even figure you, out what I'm trying to say. But you learn American English, and then I learned, to, you know, wherever, and now you're. Yeah, yeah. So I don't reveal too much about you. I'm like, <laughs> that's you flat right out on the air. Shit. Yeah, <laughs> docks, docks away. Uh, English is my third language, so 
It's mixed with a whole bunch of different languages now, yeah. For us to capsize. English is your third language. Romanian yes. and then... Uh, German. Oh yeah, that's right, German. We'll I forgot you used to be able to speak German. We'll chase them across the sea of solitude. There's so many good games, man. Seriously. We'll set sail and we won't stop until we reach safe harbor together. <laughs> I did... Hang on a minute. I thought I saw this on the Switch as it's coming up. Really? What? Well, I was too busy listening to what he was saying and stuff. Is this nah. supposed to be a whole new announcement? Because I swear to God, I saw this yeah, coming this is, up this on the is, Switch. This is the first time it's been announced, right? Hmm. You know what's crazy? Know me, that so we're in the pre-show right now. Are you ready? This is not the show that we're watching. This is the pre-show. This is the pre-show? What do they have in the actual show then? <laughs> That's how good the show is. <laughs> like captivated what's next <laughs> i know you're like what uh, sea of solitude see at the bottom it says this is the first time we've ever announced this weird what we've the heck did i see then already but we recognize there may be i love how they're still saying the whole world premiere thing. It's quite funny. puzzle games who feel left out don't worry we've got something for you too from focus home interactive here is shady part of me hey by the way you're one point down so Swinny and I are both one point total. Dang it. Ago, it was Lucky there's no the prize. Dark. I reckon I've got half a point for the Not Smash Brothers thing. The company. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. A well, there's a, the Shad there's a Smash Brothers. I should get 50 points shadow, if Kratos and Master Chief are announced. Found no hope this in looks life, really cool. But despair. Her shadow yeah, this looks awesome, the, uh, With the me, design. There is a way. It's a very unique art style. I don't know what's with the yeah, interlacing that's gameplay. though. That's gameplay, right? So it looks like gameplay. Is yeah, the interlacing is. intentional or is it just the I don't video know. I was thinking that as bit. well. I think it's the video. Maybe, but that's odd though. They, they'd be interlacing. Yeah, it's on the Switch as well. Unless Switch they... has become the to me like the underdog button. console. Oh, As in, I never thought I would spend most... Well, in the sense that it, it was always the console that I thought uh, I might play it a little bit here and there, but it's actually yeah. pr probably my primary console now. And you know, it's changed a lot for me this year because I used to always go to the office for work. Yeah. And I'd always, like, have have it on me, so I'd be playing it all the time. I'm playing a lot less this year, I've noticed. I'm playing a lot more PC games. But I still play mostly on the Switch. Oh, this is another category we've got. And we said Animal it's Crossing totally across the New board. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot 4, it's about I wish they just said the best Fall family guys, game, Animal Crossing, New Horizons. I wouldn't even yeah. bother with Mario the rest. <laughs> Although, you hey, know what? Know, Fall, Fall Guys will win. Yeah, yeah, I reckon Fall Guys will win. I feel like a lot of people would have played Mario Kart, Kart by themselves. Of course. Crossing, of course. Yeah. Yes. Well, the problem is we all got that one, so Next no extra points for me. And you're on the board. Oh, there's Robert clapping in the oh. background. The Hang on, yeah, that's that's <laughs> my lady friend. She's back home. Sorry. I'll be back. Apex Legend. Destiny 2. Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout. Fall Guys, surely. No Man's Sky and Valorant. And the winner is Fall Guys yeah. Ultimate Knockout. Social's really good on Fall Guys. I rate right, it. We get to acknowledge the winner for Very best good. debut game. This, of course, goes to nominees that represent an independent what studio's I miss? first uh, ever release. Best community support. Fall Guys. I thought it was going to be Fall Guys. Was it Fall Guys? Who was yeah. it? Fall Guys. Best community support. The nominees for best Sorry, she forgot her keys. Should have just That's all good. not even opened the door. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wait, wait five hours. <laughs> Best debut hey, game. I, I reckon Carrion. Carrion. What do you reckon? Ooh. And yeah, probably Carrion. Oh, you can't pick the same as me. Phasmophobia. Oh, oh Phasmophobia. I missed that one. Damn it. I would have picked Mortal that Shell was alright. I finished it. I liked it. Oh, was that good? Yeah. I wanted to play oh, that. It was. For the price and everything, yeah. And the, the time it took to do it was pretty good. Mm. It's a Souls game, but with a twist on the mechanics, which I thought was quite good. Yeah, because you got the thing where if you take one hit, right? Then you're uh, dead or something. Yeah, but then you get a shell, and then you get a proper health pool. It's still difficult, though. 
Mm. And then on our official channel, the biggest mechanic is there's no block. You just harden. Megadon's so you get like a chance to harden. Fortnite, uh, okay. And that basically negates the damage the from one hit. Days, but then there's a cooldown on it. So there's no block, there's no shields, nothing like that. It's good. It's worth, worth grabbing. Mm. Team Abby or Team Ellie. The votes are in and Team Ellie won the vote. Thanks for your votes what? and be sure to follow us on what TikTok was this if team? you haven't yet. It's Abby just some social stuff, content. trying to get people talking on TikTok about oh, right, okay, the Oh, yeah. Of course, you got to get the TikTok community. They do a on lot this. of, um, and the winner like, uh, team this or team that on TikTok. As for the game award, oh. we here, we've obviously won't Yeah, Ghost is killing it in fan night. support. For now, we're about to take a super short break, but coming up on the other short side, break. We've got oh. the what do you? What do you? What is this break? I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean break? Break from what? The whole thing's an ad. <laughs> Are we just gonna? Hey, thanks, Sydney. No way. Listen, it's hard for me to believe that it was 27 years hey, ago. Hey, is this a dude that didn't miss? My brother Robin and I watched players venture into the ages of the yeah, it is, for the yeah. first time. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, today I am Miss two. so excited to start a new I'm announcing Miss Two <laughs> of an entire After 25 years. constructed VR version. That's Whoa, now that's cool. Quest platform. We've got something okay, special that, for anyone. That would be sick. When's it available? Missed. They'll unlock a mist themed Oculus home environment. I'm so thrilled for you to experience mist. I might VR. be able to play this because my mate is going to lend me his uh, yeah. Oculus for. I uh, I still have a few weeks. One. That's a, oh yeah, because you got you're gonna play Alex. Oh, Let dude, me know when I'm you start Alex, because I'm yeah. gonna play it at the same time. I'm looking so forward to that. Yeah, same. What VR headset do you have? Uh, the original Quest. Oh, okay. I hope my PC can run it. Oh. Uh, what? You got the two twenty eight ETIs? Yeah, <laughs> I wish. Uh... Yeah, you'll be fine. This is really cool because I haven't played Mist since. I don't think it's a great something. game though, man. You know, what? I thought it was awesome back in the day. I loved the, the game because it had such ever, an impact. Yeah. But I get to introduce a musical really performance like right here in the pre-show. Uh oh, and I'm not we're sure gonna get our oh, channel copyright striked. Uh oh, meet it. From the Persona 5 Striker soundtrack from Tokyo, Japan. Here is Lin featuring the Persona Band. Persona Band, what a name! Game on. Hello. Are you ready? Yeah. That's a really cool pop filter, eh? That's yeah, I'm ready. I was born ready. Filter. What was that pop filter? That was really cool. I don't think that's a really good pop filter though, right? Surely. Hi. I have one somewhere. This Where is a pretty cool here? rendition, actually. They do this kind of music so awesome in Japan, man. I should have just used this the whole time. Wow, she's a really good singer. John would have liked this. Well, he's watched it all, right? I don't know. Did he watch the entire thing? I don't know who you're talking about, by the way, but, um... <laughs> oh, mate, you know, the one we should invite on the podcast one yeah, day. Yeah, a different one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that guy. Uh, <laughs> no, he's, I think he skimmed through it all. Oh, what? Yeah. Well, I guess, to be honest, that's what we would have done if we didn't sit here commenting on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But next year, I'm going to force you all to take a day off work to watch it. Oh, yeah, that'll happen. <laughs> what, you take day off work for gaming? Yeah, for, to play games, not to talk about games. What's better than playing games? Talking about playing games. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing's better than playing making games. games. Making games. Ooh. Someone brought me sushi. This is actually a perfect time to get some. Oh, uh, I didn't say that because I'm going to be hungry. <laughs> I've got no options. Just uh, communicating with... What else would I like? Coffee. And can I have a coffee, please? <laughs> Am I pushing my luck here? Probably. Am I pushing my luck? P.S. I love you. Alright. Sorry, I should be paying attention to the music. Whoa. <laughs> and you're telling me to put my stuff on quiet.
Uh, I just realized that I've been on mute oh. when I've been talking to you. Yeah, I thought Henry was in the in the room or something. Yeah, I was just saying that. Um, yeah, Henry sleeps in my room when I game. Oh, so that's he, cute. Yeah, I know. So then I, I was like, oh, I better bring him in or else he's gonna crack it. But then yeah, he barked. Then he cracked it because he wanted to get out. He just like hears anything and he's like this tiny uh. little brave dog. And then if he sees anyone, he'll run away. <laughs> Yes, Pledge was sitting on me. I feel like they're going to be like, oh, yeah, great, let's do another verse. <laughs> let's do another song. <laughs> uh, I remember, like, thank you know, you. seeing the people who watch the Oscars, like, yeah. have a party and watch the Oscars, and I was like, wow, really? how crazy wow. is that? And I'm like, we're and here we are that. doing <laughs> the gaming Oscars. <laughs> Was, of course, what have we become? Director Yoko Taro. That's all good. It's all but good the Game Awards nah, like it. will never turn down a challenge. Tonight, I am both happy <laughs> like and She's a good presenter. She's a good presenter. Yeah, she's really good, yeah. For Nier Replicant version 1.22474487139... Going. Dot, dot, dot. Okay. No teleprompter. Version... Two point seven three three one. Yeah, is this a world premiere? Because like they've already announced. Yeah, uh, it would. Nah, it's been around before. This this isn't the first time we've seen this or heard yeah. about this. Oh, I don't know. No, no, not the first time we've heard about it. We covered it on the show. Did you end up finishing this? No, no. I thought you got a copy of it, is, right? This is the original game. No, no. Yeah, but isn't did you finish the near auto a uh, near automata? Nah. Yeah, I haven't either. I need to go back to that it. Game Especially so on cool, Game Pass. Man. That game's so cool. It's really cool. Oh, I think so I think I sort of played it unfortunately in a period where I think I was moving out during oh thank you I think I was moving out <laughs> during that time or something so I, I ended up just having to put a hold on it and then yeah, I got back into it I think you've got to be in a certain headspace to play that game it's the same yeah. as um, Dark Souls for me like I'm kind of in a very casual mood at the moment so I started playing Dark Souls I'm like <laughs> oh my god good, I'm like <laughs> I, it's like I have to get myself up to play the game I have to do like a line or something like that it's to be able to play Dark Souls. Already, and now I, get to share with you <laughs> I think your hat's moving, by the way. First. No, my hat! Of a new band. You heard me correctly. What? They're playing their band. debut single, what? Follow Unfollow. Please welcome for the first time <laughs> Oh, this ever, is like OFK. brand new band. OFK. Follow oh, Unfollow. Mm. There we are. Modern. What is this? Oh, this is the digital band. Oh, no. <laughs> what is this? That's a pretty cool clip. Oh, yeah. Man, there's interlacing on this as well. It might have just been the way that they recorded it and then mm. submitted it to YouTube. It's not like they didn't process it properly. I mean, geez, like the technical nightmare to get the show to work. Like, wow. Forget about it. They recorded it in HDR, I think, actually. Like 4K HDR, I think. Oh, that was a big load. <laughs> Didn't think I could chew on That's that. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, more of it. You're on live TV, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Sorry. No need to be shy. It's fine. <laughs> Say hello to the camera. <laughs> you know what this is hey, going to be? Hey, that was mine! Mike, yes. you, know what this is you know what this is? This is going to be... Mike, you know what this is going to yeah. be? This is going to be like, in 15 years time, people are going to try to like comb inspired. through <laughs> on the videos and go, Oh, there, there! There's, there's, there's the wife! That's where it was! That's where it was! <laughs> That's her face! <laughs> That's my sushi! I'm divorcing you! Here we go. Where's the sushi you stole? Esports game. Are, what do you reckon, Mike? Thank you. Call of Duty, Could I have a coffee, Warfare. please? Yeah. I love you. <laughs> Best esports game. Fortnite, quick. League of Legends. 
Oh, wait, do we have a guess on this? I say Valorant. I say Valorant. League of Legends. <sighs> oh, wow. For best e yeah, all these still the best one. Holy are. moly, like how long has that been out for? Grabs. Rambo. <laughs> Love Who are these people? Zonic. These are the best esports coaches. Is... Don't you know these people? They have What's their actual names? names? No, there's the well, well done, Zonic. I have no idea who that is, but... The nominees Zonic. are... Blast Premier Spring 2020 European Finals. Mm. Call of Duty League Championship 2020. IEM Katowice 2020. League of Legends World Championship Yeah, League of Legends get a win. And Overwatch League Grand Finals. Is it? Oh, that was pretty cool, the Overwatch and League. And the winner is... League of Legends World Championship yeah, got 2020. It. I like the canned you don't get clapping. Any points. I like the canned ca clapping. Dash, Golden Boy. <laughs> Golden Boy, in bed. I'm going for Golden Boy. And Shocks. And I'm going for Shiver. Shocks. Oh, oh, <laughs> you're close. Oh man. I reckon Shiver should have won G2. that one. I say G2. Damn one gaming. G2. G2 Esports. Ooh. San Francisco Shock. It's the only one I know. Team Secret. I'm gonna go Winner Team Secret. G2 Esports. Oh! <laughs> I said it before it was announced. To all of the winners. And well, although the nominees were known for weeks. Athlete, here's the host of ESPN's first take and the new ESPN Plus show, Stephen A's World, Stephen A. Smith. Oh, Stephen A. Smith, how funny. I know what y'all are thinking. Did they just bring Stephen A. Smith to the Game Awards in an effort to legitimize esports as something equal to Yes, they did. Nah, Still not a legitimate spot. They're doing their thing. When every range of sports they're doing their thing. Nation, shut down, esports just kept on going. With that being said, I'll say this much. All of the esports athletes nominated are without question more determined, more tenacious, and definitely win more than anybody on the Dallas Cowboys. <gasps> oh, that's harsh. <laughs> like, if you're a Dallas Chris Cowboys fan, you're just sitting back. Showmaker. It's like, oh, I'm getting, getting potted when I'm watching the game awards. Zai Woo. I love how he has to and say the these names. Is... <laughs> I know. They've probably got it phonetically spelled out. <laughs> Showmaker. Shotzi. Oh, okay, fair enough. <laughs> I love the juxtaposition of these two people. <laughs> Showmaker! Showmaker! Hello. How are you all? <laughs> That's an aggressive haircut. <laughs> it's very it's popular, a very South haircut, Korean haircut. I'm going to see. Yeah, no, no. That haircut's super popular in those glasses, the real round ones. Oh my god, I can't believe the game awards are just starting. And now it's time for one last the pre show. For the oh my God. Show so much teasing. Come on. We've been on this for like an hour. All use a more <laughs> I know. Dragons fighting dragons. Uh, Here's Sentry, Age of Ashes. Sentry, Age of Ashes. World premiere. I can't believe me eating is now going to be immortalized on YouTube forever. Yeah. And your wife oh. as well. And yeah. <laughs> I'll put a timestamp. <laughs> <laughs> I warned her. That's like a Penza Dragoon saga. To remind yeah. Multiplayer dragon fighting. Interesting. Looks like uh, Battlefield meets Dragons. Dragon Field. <laughs> dragon Battle Dragons. <laughs> That's not too far away. Century Age of Ashes. Okay. We're in PC only. Interesting. Oh. Maybe for now. And with that, it means I'm about to sign off and hand it over to Jeff. Look forward to performances from Eddie Vedder and the London Philharmonic Orchestra. Ooh. We'll be playing the traditional Game of the Year medley as well mm. as a special. I do like that game. Do you think going to do some medley. Last of Us stuff? Yeah, they do every year. Guys, like they Dragon have a Super symphony that mm. basically plays a medley of all the nominees. And of course, so I'm looking forward to when they do Animal Crossing. That'd be really cool. Dude. Was he it in The Last of Us? Did he do music for the them? Who? Start right now. Eddie. Eddie Vedder? No. He didn't. 
Mm. It's the kind of music that I feel would fit really well in the game, though. There's a lot of guitar music, right? So. Hmm. Hey, you. you st oh, wait. Hmm. No, I just I thought you zoomed in or something like that, but it was just you were standing to the side. Hello, everyone around the Oh, look at this, the statement the sneakers. They've even got the oh, spotlight. Oh, it's the They've power move. Spotlight. It's the power sneakers. <laughs> <laughs> it's like when I rock, rock up to work in my Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> I just got pink, pink flamingos everywhere. I know that can't happen for all of us, but tonight we can gather here and connect around games, something that we all love. Games connect us. And I'm here in Los Angeles. We're okay. watching live right now in China early in the morning, in Europe, America, my native Canada, Australia. wherever Australia. you are. Australia. Uh, Say it. Australia. In India this year. All over the globe, we are coming even in together tonight. India, didn't even 1.5 tell billion people. <laughs> uh, now, to keep everyone safe tonight, I mean, like, are going to be what, us you couldn't watch it in India Zoom last year? How does that work? You can see them there. Is it like a They don't have a firewall there, do they? China, Europe, Los I doubt Los they would have firewalled this. And we will have all these guys I'm trying to look at the people's us, names. Tonight, as we get yeah. through all the awards mm. live in the show. Uh, we're going to be Because all the people who haven't dialed in yet, basically. Guests, and they're probably Keanu sweating Reeves, in the back room. Gadot, Dial in! Larson, Tom Holland, who do I have to call? Nolan, John David Washington, Christopher Nolan, that's sick. Chef, that's Christopher Nolan's Reggie presenting. And, more, and we also mm. have a very special performance by Eddie Vedder from Pearl Jam. Uh, he will Pearl be in Jam. Seattle. And the London Philharmonic Orchestra from Abbey Road Studios in London conducted by Lauren Balfe. It is going to be an amazing show. And as always, we've got the awards. We've got first looks. We've got new game announcements. It's very, um, I, I didn't see it last year, so I don't know what it looked like. Here. But and the whole black with red motif, to to you know, that games. typical gaming color, or at least I thought everyone was here. which it does happens to be exactly like what the PC is right next to me in the hat. To arrive. No, I didn't think it was. I mean, it's different because they've built a purpose built stage for it, right? So. Oh! Here we go. Uh. Smash Brothers. Dude, I'm like super excited. I but is right. it. Wait up. I... Okay, this was the intro to the I game. I can't believe right? they're starting <clears throat> with Smash Brothers. That's sick. I already got half yeah, a but point. Who's the, new, who's the new one? Let's Who see. Who is it? Pit. Interesting. No, oh, this is the intro to the game. No, no, no. They, this is the video. Like, this is custom. Is it? Yeah, yeah. But the intro to the game is like this as well, isn't it? No. Well, you know, it's a riff off it. Oh, but it's not it's the actual. Sliced in half. Who sliced it in half? My, is like, it? My heart's racing. Who the hell is this? Sephiroth. Sephiroth. <gasps> oh. <laughs> well, none of us guessed him, but okay. No. But I got half a point anyway. Oh, you get half a point for what? <laughs> I said no, Smash no, character. no, 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 no. It's got to be the actual guesses. <laughs> That's like me saying I'll get half a point because it's hit something about VR. This is really cool. Is it gonna cost fifteen bucks? How how, how are these characters priced now? Mm, they're like five or six dollars each or something. Okay, fair enough. But you buy them in a pack normally. Oh, of course, you can't just pick eight no, characters. Can buy like Forza, individual. you can't. No, no, you can well, actually, buy them no, no, that's right, you can't buy them, okay. Because yeah, Forza, no, I fair. swear to God, originally you couldn't actually buy an individual car, you had to buy the pack. But then I think they changed it and you could buy individual cars. And it's kind of crazy when the entire game's 20 bucks, but a car's going to cost you five. Oh, uh, that's like, um, there's a new game called Fuser. So it's like a, mm. a DJ version of, or like DJ Hero, right? You mash yeah. up songs. And the packs, it's like 20 songs for like 50 Australian dollars. It's like, damn, wow. man. It's pretty oh. violent for like Nintendo. Ah, oh, there you go. That's mad. This was <laughs> that's actually... Mad. Did you see that? That's, that's awesome. Yeah, I saw that. That was really cool, yeah. That's funny. This is pretty cool. I still think my my way would have been better. Oh, what the hell? So wait, <laughs> Sephiroth... R refresh my memory here. Sephiroth is Cloud's ex-girlfriend, right? <laughs> what was the relationship again? Oh, 
じっとしていてくれ。はい、こわたしは。思い出にはならないさ。でも、アニメーションしないと。That's a, that was a really cool quote at the end. Love that. Ah, oh, that's awesome. It's actually coming out really soon. Because, like, with the, with the last few, it's been like ages. All right, the fun is just hmm. getting started. But of course, this show is also about awards. I like it. That's awards. cool, man. Uh, so, what do I do? Do I put it as half winner, half loser? Nah, uh, look, we're going to have to to talk with Swinney and figure it out. Well, let me put both on at the moment. It's Brie Larson. Hey, Brie. Is this another Hello. Nintendo announcement? Tonight, I am honored to present the award for best performance. Among the nominees is an inclusive group of talented actors filling vastly different roles in games that are nothing alike. However, a real bad these camera. artists are nominated tonight for mm. what they share in common, a clear dedication to their craft and an extraordinary ability to bring humanity and empathy to their roles. Here are the nominees for best performance. I like when she was like reading and then like looks up. It's gonna be someone from Last of Us, right? It's gotta be. But you know why I think that as well? Just because so much people gave them crap, like the actual actresses. Like on socials and stuff like that, and they went after them. Mm. Yeah, I think she'll win. Possibly. Yeah. And what is it, Lisa Bailey? I haven't played Miles, so I'm not sure. And the game up. award goes to. There we go. Wow, they're actually all there. That's crazy. Laura Bailey. As yeah. Boom. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh wow. Um. Wow. So, uh, this is so weird. I... <laughs> what? I was such it's a so fan awkward watching this because it's live. Like uh, what? You know their reaction. performances within it. Um, you mean like ours? <laughs> Other people are going to watch us and go, man, these so guys are awkward. They're just sitting there like... No surprise to me that uh, Abby's role in this story has been met with such... Wait, uh, I need to make a phone call to get some, some coffee. But, no, um, I don't want the cat. I like how you tell this thing and then you like... Such a fantastically challenging character. Wait, I better pay attention to this. Her through her story really and enables the player to find... Hey, I, I, I might get against spoilers on the game awards. I just bought this game. Yeah, you might want to just <laughs> I know, I know. take like, your uh... and and the twist ending when I when I I was the zombie all along. <laughs> My performance to it's amazing watching her and remembering Abby in the game. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's kind of weird, actually. Yeah. Not not in a bad way, just it's surreal because the voice sounds so familiar. Also, how but the good they are. At like All the facial animations and, and stuff and the tracking the way, and everything. Um, yeah. To Patrick and Ian and Grace for. Although uh, I think they should have made Abby look like her. The, the, the story and Abby mm. would not have been as impactful without you by my side. Um, did she just get a phone call Troy, or something? Who? Was no, that, that wasn't me. That was her. <laughs> really? <laughs> I don't think that was me. I wasn't silent, dude. <laughs> so she just got a text. I guess it's like all live at the time, right? Yeah. Neil Druckmann. Like, congrats. <laughs> nice work. Nice work. <laughs> Thank you for always having my back. We want to win a lot of awards. We've already won. Ashley. Yes. One. We will win all of them. <laughs> Wait, how many have they won so far? One, yeah? Or two? That, see, again, that wasn't me, dude. That wasn't me. That was on the Put thing. Put your phone on silent, bro. Man, I feel like we're more professional. Dude, my phone is on silent. We're more professional than these people. <laughs> Although you've had people on who are not you on your screen. I love you, <laughs> Who? I don't know. Not her husband, obviously. <laughs> Marry me and to my husband. And also my husband. <laughs> hmm. We probably should have paid attention to, to that bit. Voted, thank you for your support and for your love and for We didn't we didn't have a guess at this one because you probably definitely would have gotten this one right. This no, we got we got Swinney. He's he's he stuffed me over, man. I've I've guessed so many Why? of these categories. We should have guessed every category because yeah, we're we watching the whole show. Hang on just a sec. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm I need some coffee. So great to have everyone here celebrating and amazing your games. All right, we're streaming on every Sorry, Jeff, just a sec. Just wait a sec. Just a sec. Drops for Among Us and Fortnite.
You're gonna miss the drops from Among Us and Fortnite. Oh, hello. Could I please have a coffee? On Twitch, you can predict who you think will win using a Twitch Any coffee? First up, best ongoing We're games recording your breakup now, right now. Yeah, but yeah, but I gotta do this thing till one of those special years. Like twelve way past midnight. Of new next -gen till midnight. Consoles. And with that, way past that. Yeah, but then I can play Cyberpunk till four a.m. It's fine. Oh, come on, please. Do you want me to Uber you a coffee? I'll give you a massage afterwards. Right wow, this is this is getting R rated. Enjoy. Okay, fine. Well, what do you want? Hey, yeah. wait, 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 we gotta watch this. Watch this. Watch this. A list of demands. You can have one thing. That's it. One thing, not a whole list. Yes, we are, and I have no idea who this guy talking is now. Oh, you know what? You know what? Maybe just boil the coffee and get one of the sachet things. These corporations came in. Yeah, just a sachet. That'll do. Wow, this looks really cool. What is this? Oh, I don't know, because you're talking over. Yeah, but it's for a little coffee. I gotta go now, sorry. My one or two fans will be very disappointed at this little interjection. What is Alright, thanks, boo. <laughs> See ya. You getting your yes. coffee? Yes. The initiative. Are you getting your coffee? Yeah, I am. Excellent, excellent. What kind of coffee? Decaf? Whatever, I'll take whatever I can get. This looks really cool. <laughs> That's what your is normal this? style. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Is that Australia? Anyway, that Australia, anyhow. right? Australia. Well, not anymore it isn't, because it's all underwater now. The flood. Wow, that water animation is not that great. The fires. Well, it's kind of in fast forward. People dying in the street. This looks really cool. I wish I didn't miss the start of it. The corporations gave us solutions. A better world. A better world? Uh, interesting. But the laws of nature aren't meant to be broken. We need to know what they're hiding. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm not vibing this, but you are. I'm totally vibing this. I want to oh. know what's a, what it's about, yeah. I just think it looks really flashy, but I don't really understand what's going on. Well, that's the thing. I, w I want to know what, what this is. What is this? Is this nature turning on people and destroying civilization? What is this? What kind of game is it? Does it... Find the answers you were looking for, Agent Dark. Not yet. Oh, is whoa, this whoa. a new, uh... No way. Whoa! Yeah. Wow. Damn. There you go. You were on it. So he's gonna I love this. It. Now I love it. No, oh, yeah, all of you like, oh, I'm not feeling this. I'm not feeling this. Oh my god, this is gonna be the best game ever. Hey, I'm gonna get this for free as well on Game Pass. That's true, because it's go. Xbox Studios. Oh, the the, Xbox, very that's exciting to have my favorite game now. All right, well, we're gonna go right <laughs> into another game announcement. I totally felt right that. I was just vibing yeah, that you trailer. totally felt that. Yeah. Are you gonna edit that part out? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I just clipped okay. this. I was vibing just the whole it. thing. You didn't say anything. Oh, what's this? It sounds like Westworld's music, you know. Kind of is that that intro reminds me of the intro to um, what was that game? Um, Tom Clancy's... The latest Whoa, Tom Clancy really one. Oh, yeah. zombies! Yes! Oh, oh yeah. Zombie game. We don't have a zombie game, do we? This isn't Dead Island. <laughs> that would Dead be Island awesome! <laughs> the new game of the year? Of next year <laughs> when it comes out? 2021, exactly. 10 years later. No, this looks more like Left 4 Dead 3 or something. That would be nuts if it's Left 4 Dead 3. I mean, they're moving really fast. It kind of does look Left 4 Dead 3. I reckon it probably is. Damn! Is it? Probably. I hope they. I hope it is so we can play it and I can keep pissing everyone off by. Yeah, you are, yeah, you're driving me nuts. You're so <laughs> selfish. You're single Running child. ahead and just. <laughs> single child mode. <laughs> causing all sorts of uh, havoc. I reckon it is. is yeah, see, she's gonna start screaming now. Oh no, wait, this is a different one. Four hands. Ew. Oh, yuck. Although it is kind of hot. I mean, like, 
This is like kind of almost a blatant ripoff of Left 4 Dead if this is not Left 4 Dead. If right? it isn't. Yeah, but then there's other games that are like World War Z sort of. Yeah, but four people, fast zombies, all that kind of stuff. Yeah, well, World War Z, how many people are in World War Z? I think this is Left 4 Dead 3, is it? <laughs> like, like you said, if it isn't, I'd be very surprised. This is not be this is Left 4 Dead. Dead are left. I mean, this isn't this isn't gameplay. Right? This is just. Is yeah, this, this gameplay? This, um, it's hard I don't to know tell anymore. nowadays. To be I know, it's so hard to tell. It's really hard nowadays. I don't think it is. If this is Left 4 Dead 3, this is like the first third game in a Valve series, right? Uh yes, it would be, wouldn't it? Back for no, blood. this is back. This is almost like a riff off Left 4 Dead. Or <laughs> back blood. For blood. That's like. <laughs> okay. Wait. I'm so confused. I'm, I'm very confused. Ashton of Turtle Rock Studios. Uh, this is pretty exciting for all us Left 4 Dead fans. Of course, uh, you guys are known for all the <laughs> work. Dead, yes, it is. Now you're building uh, this. I'm uh, building on the legacy with this new zombie co op. Building on the shooter. legacy. Uh, oh, okay. What's uh -huh. new? So this is like, well, yeah. We Wait, I'm so, so it is the I, spiritual successor actually, of it. Right? I don't know the backgrounds of the whole Turtle Rock thing. Uh, more mm. Are they not a part of Valve? Or? Or story? I don't know. Uh, but we also wanted to have a bigger variety of zombies to fight. Right? Right, but also we wanted to go bigger. So now we've got these twenty foot. Everyone tall, loves it bigger. Uh, zombie <laughs> monstrosities that are definitely. Hey, Boo, do you like it bigger? You know, the help of your zombie friends in order to defeat. All right, I'm talking well, about games and zombies. This game announced, but it sounds like I, I think you've prepared a little surprise for everyone watching, right? Oh yeah. It's like, on Stadia uh, right now. These are cool, but uh, turn into a zombie. Game, right? So let's yeah, see some of here's that. gameplay. Okay, and buy. Oh, here we go. Here's a game Just next. Oh, good. Blood. Yes. So that wasn't gameplay, I suppose. Pre-alpha. <laughs> pre-alpha. So that's what like what? Someone's machine on their no desk. Thing. That's a, it's just alpha. Alpha, by definition, is the start. Yeah, isn't it? exactly. I mean, does this this almost looks better than the trailer? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like seriously, this is so far almost looks better than the trailer. Oh, this looks really good, man. It looks cool, man, but I'm not falling for any of this anymore. Every single one of these multiplayer games, like Anthem, is just so scripted and so... Yeah, it's true. I know, I know, I know. Running Nothing like, like the, the real thing, so... Machines, yeah. Well, it looks super solid. Very COD-like shooting, which is a good thing. You, you know what? It Like, the trailer made it seem like way more like Left 4 Dead. And then now watching this, this doesn't look as much like Left 4 Dead for me. No, but this looks good. This looks like it'd be fun to play, I reckon. Yeah, for sure. Oh, well, yeah, see, be... in reality, there's no way you could kill that thing that quickly, I reckon. <laughs> I'm calling it now. I mean, in the real world where there's zombie monstrosities. No, you know what I mean, when the game actually comes out. I don't know, I think that was just like a basic enemy. Maybe it was. Wait, this, did, did you just run off and left all the other people to try to fight yeah, that thing off? This is Mike gameplay. This is Mike gameplay. Oh, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is Mike gameplay. <laughs> Screw guys, I'm going for it. I'm not I want to get all the armor and ammo. <laughs> 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 um, have you played uh, Doom Eternal? Yes. Yes, I have. I would love if there was like a co-op Doom Eternal style game. That'd be fun. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, maybe it has co-op i haven't actually checked but oh it's got multiplayer but i don't know if it's got co-op but i'm in a game that's built from the start by the way the amount of like auto aiming that just happened there was crazy like the bullets were flying up and, like, well, i think that was right there. i don't know if there was auto aim or it was uh lack of accuracy because he wasn't aiming down the site uh maybe hey, this looks this looks uh more than pre-alpha. <laughs> yeah, true, yeah. That's pretty solid already, yeah. What? And it's coming out in, like, six months. Oh, is it pre-alpha pre footage, but it's coming out in six months? Like, Where's is it six months worth alpha? of development to get it to <laughs> beta? No, to get it to alpha, <laughs> then to beta, then to actual release. But it looks alright. <clears throat> looks okay. Go, I'll play that. Blood, June next year. Alpha next week. Crazy. All right. Very exciting. Well, tonight we're celebrating games Alpha and we've got week. awesome discounts on many of tonight's nominees with the Game Awards sale across Xbox, PlayStation, uh -huh. Nintendo, Straight Wii Shop, for the Wii That's on right now, right? Well, we couldn't we check I don't know. I got a lot of alerts, but I didn't check them just in case. Little Nightmares 2 
and some of the games are also available I instantly with GeForce Now. So make sure to check that out. You can stream on. See, a that is really cool what happened. Thing. Huh? To GeForce now. I'm saying like well, we you know the streaming thing allows you yeah. for like some really cool stuff like being able to go. Okay, it's it's available. Go check it out now. It's like, oh, that's cool. I'm gonna check it out after this. Did you hear what happened with Hardware Unbox, that Australian dude, <clears throat> well, Australian channel? Thanks, Jeff. I do have a really exciting Did you hear what happened? You, what? First, uh, NVIDIA said that they weren't going to send him review copies of the cards anymore because he effectively, because he wasn't reviewing or looking at the ray tracing component enough. I mean, the whole thing's advertising, right? Like, basically, it's advertising, yeah. And they, you know, he wasn't advertising the right thing, so yeah, it's it's a little, yeah, it's a little I mean, concerning. But he should just buy it. Buy it and and there's a lot of reviewers that I follow that they don't get anything from their publishers, so they just yeah, like, they have oh, to get their own and stuff. Just yeah. have to wait until it comes out, play it like crazy, or review it like yeah, because then it's also a more honest review. There is absolutely zero bias in it. I would imagine at that point, other than you know your own personal bias, anyway. Yeah, for sure. Now, I need you. In saying that, if there's if anyone's watching and you guys have anything you want me to review or do a video of on my my YouTube thing, then you know, go ahead. <laughs> so what what is this game? It's a multiplayer. Everything is in place. I was about to say I'm not super excited about it, and then they're probably going to get excited at all. This like is just exactly what I like. <laughs> then I'll be like, oh, I love it. <laughs> Oh, it's Metroid yes. Prime 4? Oh, wow, great. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, this is crap. Oh, wow, wow, the best game ever. <laughs> oh, Nintendo made it. Oh, 10 out of 10. Starts right now. If you're part of our community, yeah, I don't know about this. There's too many games, man. There's too many games. There's too many, and they're like, this whole multiplayer Fortnite thing. I mean, I'm sure it'll be fun. Honestly, there's too many 9 out of 10 games to play in a lifetime almost. That's the problem as well. Yeah, there's so many good games. Like 10 out of 10. I'm just thinking about. It's, it's, you know, you probably could get through every 10 There's even 10 out of 10s 10 that are, there's so many of them, I reckon, that... Oh, you reckon? Oh, yeah, you easily. I mean, you I still haven't played God of War. I haven't True. played... There's a ton of games I haven't played. Probably because I play other less great games. Um, well, the graphics in this look really good. But even, you know, Cyberpunk, I can see myself spending a lot of hours in that game. I'm probably yeah, not yeah, finishing yeah, it. Sure. Well, you, you've only got past the character creator, right? Uh, didn't even get past that. I, I spent about an hour just changing my my penis size. <laughs> just zooming in and out. You just you can't. Hey, I hey, couldn't hey, figure out what button it was to let's, zoom in. Let's, let's keep it uh, PG. <laughs> and you know what else? I reckon I was very disappointed. I almost deleted careful, the game when this be happened. Be careful. Yeah, go on. There was no physics. There was no swinging physics. Oh really? Yeah, yeah I didn't know. They need the Japanese for that. Yeah, that's true. They would need that. Oh, here we go, here we go. What's this? Now I'm excited. Oh, wait. I thought they were yeah, announcing it so new, many uh... good games on the Switch, man. Like, if all you owned is a Switch, you'd be laughing, to be honest. Oh, yeah, there's a ton of really good games. Yeah, oh, maybe there's a Switch Pro announcement. Stardew Valley. Many hours have put into that. I was playing that with Swinney and his uh, brother-in-law. What? Overcooked? Yeah. yeah <laughs> we weren't so doing good. too well. <laughs> Almost had a divorce playing that game. What? Oh, dude, that game is like so bad for a marriage. <laughs> it's so bad. I played it with my partner. It was fine. We enjoyed it. It probably just exposes all the deep-seated problems in our relationship. Maybe, yeah. Uh, <laughs> her and I don't really have problems. Anyways, She's the back. Instagram and the Game Awards have teamed up for Walking six back. new AR effects you can share to Instagram Reels. I played with them yesterday. So what? what? The announcement is that they made AR Reels. effects? The announcement is they made you social can transport yourself to integrated marketing. Train station, transform into the Doom Slayer, don the mask, Man, I'm too old for this. <laughs> Way too old for this. Sneak through The Last of Us or even become Zagreus from Hades. To create your own, just head over to the Game Awards on Instagram, click on the effect icon, and share to Instagram Reels. And I'll be it's back to show off It's some super of your expensive to buy those reels, like to create them. 
Why licensing or what? Yeah, oh. like you know when you work with uh, Snapchat. You mean Instagram? There's a, there's a company I worked for that was like talking to them. Hey, is that? Yes, it is. Huh? Cool. It's the car from Cyberpunk in Forza. Ah, sick. That's cool. That is pretty cool. Would you ever get like a full-on crazy setup like for your PC? What do you mean? Like driving a steering wheel and all that kind of stuff. I already have one. For your PC? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, I don't use it You have one with like lot, the monitor but... where you put the thing on your head so you can move your head around and it moves No, less. I don't have anything like that. No, I wouldn't get that. What happens to my that. coffee? Hey, what to my for coffee? Uh, but welcome back. Now coming up next, we're going to present the best fun call. game award in the Twitch <laughs> community. My, my Uber <laughs> like, I'm person have, like, hasn't arrived. Um, Timestamps for all the phone calls you made on air. Well, let's find out the Twitch community is right. I have to file a complaint to the E. recognizes five outstanding titles that can to Uber Network. Here are the nominees. H Hello, Uber Network. Wait, wait, wait. I think I think we uh game. yeah we we voted for this one. We voted for this one. Are so we I said please? Destiny Two. You yes. said No Man's Sky, and Swinny said Fortnite. Okay, okay I won. <laughs> okay, thank you. I'll see you soon. Bye. Did you hear me? No, no. What were you saying? Oh, I said. <laughs> I said, we've voted for this. Best oh, yes, we did vote for this. So That's I right, said yeah. Destiny 2, you said No Man's Sky, and Swinny said yes. Fortnite. Well, so okay. we'll it'll be Fortnite, here, right? All right here we you're, go. you're one point uh, behind us, by the way. Is... So you need this. Well, that's because the game award goes you only have two points, no right? I've got one. Oh, you got it! <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Can't believe it. Uh, it would have been almost my last pick. <laughs> he actually does look legit. Shock. Yeah, he's probably like me. Like, what? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I believed in you. I believed in you. Shit. We're really lucky. You know, we get to come to work every day and make games. No Man's Sky is such a wonderful game to work on. I wouldn't say I'm in the minority, but and I love the no game from when it first came out, even with its flaws. So moments like this it, like they mean a lot you know how you we were know, talking earlier to me, that to the there's just thank too many games so out much. there right thank you mm. so any game that does something Sports. slightly different it's always yes. going to be so helpful right yeah and the, the game did do something different right? oh totally i reckon yeah i don't think people just had every year leading uh, super high expectations a lot of mm. a lot of games well i think they're hyped up though. Anticipating. it was hyped yeah you you're not expecting like this and I, I guess, this. yeah, we're old and bitter now, so we know we, we need to keep our... Uh, <laughs> born like, Cyberpunk's a perfect example, right? I'm just growing into it. I kept my... Uh, you're growing into it. I kept my expectations at bay. Mm. And even with all the bugs and stuff, which I knew were going to happen, I'm well, you, really you gotta, enjoying you got to save now. this juice for the, the main... The okay, teaser fine. for the main party. Yeah, I, can't, I can't say anything to you guys <laughs> anymore. I have to keep my mouth shut about everything. <laughs> It's gaming related now. <laughs> Until one day a week, I'm allowed to talk. What is this? Hours. North Korea? <laughs> what is this? I missed what they were talking about. I didn't uh, see World Premiere. I think it only kind of show the name of the game. Oh. What is this a boot? Yeah, what the hell? Why is your Battlestar Galactica? But fear itself. <laughs> FDR. Ugh. Mm, pretty hot. Oh, I thought he was going to be the protagonist. Maybe not. This isn't like Dead, Dead <laughs> like, Space Forest. Maybe things. not. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe maybe it's the thing that gets into him and now he gets some sort of... Yeah, but of I'm not sure he'd be the antagonist then, wouldn't he? Well, no, he just gets some... I'm not sure if that guy's a good guy. Maybe the aliens are the good him. guys. <laughs> you just killed Maybe him. the humans are the baddies. Is yeah, this could be the, interesting. The I wonder Callisto what it's... Protocol. The Callisto 2022. Protocol, yeah. Jeez. It's a cool name. 2022. 
I wonder if it's gonna be, you know, sort of like a Dead Spacey kind of game. Because we need something like that. That was such a good game. Yeah, maybe you've you know, maybe there's gonna be a new Dead Space game. I'm feeling today. some Dead Space vibes and there's little Oh, 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 oh Debbie, Debbie, my game. I should be hosting my own game awards show. Alright, you do the next one. You intro. Okay. Look what up, homie? Nice oh wait, well, it's a dude from Dead Space. Oh, it is actually. Over a year and a half with a team of Glenn Shuffield. Over a hundred people on it. It's a single-player, third-person, story-driven <laughs> survival horror game set in the. You mean Dead Space? <laughs> you predicted this. How many? How many inspired games are there? Like Back for Dead or whatever it was called. For PC yeah, that's true. Consoles. That are basically just the third part of, or the fourth part. Spiritual successor. That's what this show is called. Awesome. Spiritual successor. Yeah, so far. Forward to hearing more about that next year right, i'm looking forward to that one warhammer 40k yeah, dark cool. tide is a four-player co-op game from fat shark the developers behind warhammer vermintide warhammer well, tonight, 40k we're sharing a first look at the gameplay do, do, Check do, this do, out. Do, do. have you ever played warhammer or know anything yep. about it um as in i played very little of it but i have yeah the actual tabletop part and i, I played like, some of the games i can't believe there's like stores in sydney that are just dedicated oh, to this, Warhammer. yeah the stores here as well yeah, there used to be like, one at uh I think High Point was the one I remember. Oh yeah, yeah, I remember that. I remember the that. Northwest, yeah. There's a, there's a bunch of other ones, but that was a fairly decentish one. But it's always kind of empty, unfortunately. But it's it's just incredible to me that like yeah, there's obviously such a loyal fan base. Eh? I guess nowadays with you know the cost of a storefront and people buying stuff online, it's probably harder for them to keep stores like that open in big locations like that. This looks pretty solid, actually. Hey, so I've got an idea for a game. You know how yeah. I was just talking about there's too many games? Yes. So I'm like, okay, how can I how can I come up with a concept for a game that hasn't been thought before? Mm. I think I've told Swinny this idea. So the idea of the game is, it it's is like a survival first-person shootery type game, right? Where you can build, oh. craft, and like have your little vault or something like that, remake. right? Ghost of hang on, hang on, just give me a sec. Who's gonna get this, on this We didn't vote on this. We didn't. No. I reckon it's gonna be so Ghost Ori, of Tsushima. Ori. Ori. Thank you. Ooh, you got it. Nice. For best action game, the nominees are... Oh, we got... Yeah, we all Doom voted Eternal, for Doom, though. <laughs> Half-Life Alex. Neo best action two, game. We all Streets voted for Doom. Rage 4. It'd probably and be Streets of Rage 4. Is Hades. Hades? Super Giant. Oh, okay. In the category of best VR Well, this is AI, easy, this one. The nominees are... Alex. Half-Life Alex. Marvel's Iron Man VR. Star Wars... It's Squad gotta be Alex. Come on. It'd be disgusting. They should have been for the... the game you know, the... To Game of the year. Half Life Alex, congratulations. Obviously. For best sports racing game. Oh, we voted on this. Okay, so I said uh, Tony Hawk, and so did Swinney, and you said Dirt 5. Here we go. Okay. And we're all even points now. Oh, right. And the game award goes to Tony Hawk's Pro Yeah! Oh, You're damn. behind again. I mean, not damn, it's deserved. Anticipated game. Voted on on Twitter this year. The nominees are Elden Ring. Elden Ring. There I said it. God of War sequel, Halo Infinite, Horizon Forbidden West. What do you reckon? Resident Evil Village, Elden Ring. And The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Oh, that was Wait, God of War well. sequel. That's what I God of no. War sequel would be up there. I just well. said that there was going to be a Elden Ring. Yeah, Elden, Elden Ring. Ring. To software. <laughs> All right. This next game comes from the For some reason I thought you, you ordered a coffee. Company <laughs> like, oh, Elden Ring from where? Right. No, coffee. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was thinking. Wait. I don't know, McCafe coffee or something maybe. I don't know. No, no, I didn't order McCafe coffee. I just got my <laughs> Oh, that that's cool. I like that cup. Cool, cool little cup. So yeah, can I tell you my idea? Oh, what what is this? Maybe we've got to watch this actually. Yeah. My name is Testavine. And the world is passing me by. Mm. I guess as I get a little older, I'm starting to feel how things change. They decline and go away. That's how it was with my grandma. I loved her so much. I thought I knew her better than anyone. But looking through her old things, we found Ooh, I like the hints of something crazy. she knew yeah. to tell us about. This kind of reminds me of, um... Even if it wasn't my grandfather... What became of Edith? Finch? Well, that's Some what I was wondering, because Fulbright, is that Edith Finch, people? 
I don't we can't know. Ask her about these things anymore, this is why we need so... Swinny. We have to go He's gonna watch this and be like, ah, you idiots. Yeah, he's like, ah, you idiots. It's this. <laughs> well, why don't you come on the show then? He's gonna have like 20 corrections at the start of the next <laughs> <laughs> I need to correct the guys on this and this and this and this and this. Open rights. Hmm. Starring. Hmm. I don't know who they are, unfortunately. Again, Swinney's like, oh, could I feel you like not know video who Russell is? For too long. All right, once again this year, we're excited to share some stories about people around the world who are making a positive impact on the gaming community. These are our global gaming citizens in partnership with Facebook Gaming. Our first honoree tonight is Latinx in Gaming. We've Check only got four more awards. <laughs> that That's we've it. <laughs> yeah, but there's like still another <laughs> two hours. <laughs> two hours left. <laughs> <laughs> when I, was I suppose I gotta listen to music. music All right, can I stuff. can I tell you my idea for a game? Yeah, yeah, go on. So I this is this is like a game idea. Now. I think would be I like massive, well. right? I was often yeah. I should pitch it. I should try to get money to make it. Take a year off. About how hard it was for so me my idea is that the the mechanic of the game it's like a massive world, right? Yeah. There's only one world. So like an MMO. Yeah. You go in. You have like. At a minimum, that are dedicated like you have to play like 90 minutes every day, right? Uh -huh. Or otherwise, people can break into your vaults and you know kill you or take all your stuff, right? Okay. And it's like asynchronous. You can open up like and play at any time during that 24-hour period, right? Okay. Yeah. And the idea of the game is to play the game. And again, this is like linking into this idea of you have to um, you have to do something different to catch people's attention, right? So this game. You have to go, oh, here's my ID, like my passport or something like that, right? To prove you are who you are, right? Okay. And you only ever get one life in the game, ever. Right? Wait, did you tell me about this before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one life thing. And, and who the hell the person, will play that, though? The, the, I play that. No, listen, the last person standing in the world gets a million dollars. I still wouldn't play it. <laughs> and it's free to play. It's not free, you just have my identity. No, but we have a process to get rid of all that data. Anyway. We're only doing that to make sure that people can't scam it. I think that's a mad idea. I think people would play that shit. Best emerging Valorant streamer from our global Why do they put list. there? We'll announce the winner before the end of the show, and then we'll all go raise. So yeah, do you reckon people will play my game? Or not? Again, I want to thank you all for playing. Oh Valorant. look, the people will play anything, dude. Taste. So <laughs> thanks. <year>. Yes. <laughs> Cheers. Appreciate You're it. You're welcome. It. <laughs> people play anything. <laughs> <laughs> no, I reckon they would play that. Yeah. I think it's a cool. It's like a game that I feel like. I got this. People would advertise it for, for me because they'd just be like, oh, you want a million a million bucks playing a game? You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, it'll, 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 it'll probably, just because of that unique spin on it, people will probably definitely play it. And steal people's passports and create f fake identities and all sorts nah, of Nah, you know shit. how serious I uh, treat that stuff. Uh, I guess. Wait, and this? I thought about it, I'm like, oh, you know what? You'd have to be a prick and go, Anyone born on your birthday with your name, they only have one person like that that can play the game. Wow. But now why? Why though? Because you can because have... Because what I want to do is take your name and your birthday and then hash it. So I don't know what it is. Well, right? you could just hash other forms of ideas part of that, you know? No, but oh, then, then they get a scam it. They get a scam it. I've thought about right it, man. I've thought about it a lot because I've got a scamming brain. <laughs> I'm like, how can I make this pretty much foolproof? <laughs> so, I mean, what they could do is they could go, oh, here's another passport. People have multiple passports. But I figure a passport is a big this is hurdle. Such a shit ad. Jump. Yeah. Pokemon Go and catch some Wooper while you watch this evening. What? I hate ads like that. This is like wild because like they just show stuff and I don't even know like did is they just Disco transition Elysium? into coming it or on not? Switch? Oh yeah, yeah, um, Disco Elysium, right? Yeah, but is it coming on Switch? I think is that what there might be a for? prequel game coming out. One last time. The final oh, cut like coming on Switch. The world is waiting. That narrator sounds so cool. You know these developers are like full-on communists. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Some people ha having been to through the whole communist thing, communist. I don't know if I support that, but this game looks awesome, so whatever. I mean, communist works really well in every country in that's ever had it. <laughs> yeah, it's worked brilliantly in every country that's ever had it. Such a cool. I mean, but it's very much human nature. It's like, let's try it again, though. Yeah. Ow, <laughs> oh, that hurts. <laughs> They're just like, but if we Sal, did it this hurt. way, if we did it that way, <laughs> yeah, may maybe they just didn't get it right the last fifty <laughs> times they tried it. <laughs> but if I grab the boiling water with two hands, <laughs> but that didn't work either. Oh well, well, maybe if I had three hands, <laughs> maybe if I dunk my head in. <laughs> Man, it was still crazy. I remember watching the the dictator being executed. Yeah, I remember you spoken about that in heaps Back of times. in the 90s, yeah. RPG, Disco Elysium. Oh, okay. The what? Cut, a free upgrade for all players. But where's this? Whoa, switch? how weird is this? I must have done oh, a deal man. with PlayStation. Wow. It must have. I Damn. Thought, no, but it says Steam and... Well, just Steam, I guess. But, but it was already on PC. It was already on PC. Yeah, okay. And it's a free upgrade. So it's basically, uh, yeah, uh, what's it oh, called, PS5. Edition, cool. The PS5 <laughs> version. Oh, this PS4, to, PS5. It needs to come out on the Switch, man. It'd be such a cool Switch game. Oh, it could run on it. Welcome back Probably could run on it, yeah, why wouldn't That's it? so exciting. Disco Elysium news. You may remember last year, they were, I think, they won the most awards out of any game last year at the Game Awards. So awesome. Oh. News. All right. Well, now we're going to talk about Bioware's Dragon Age franchise. It is known Ooh, for its story and its characters. This oh, is the dodgy, no. right now, the dodgy guess that we player. had, that it was already the out, you know? Of what to expect in the next game and where it will take you, you, He must have had a hunt, because my guesses were completely made up. Like, I, I didn't even think about it much. Well, you probably read I, it somewhere, because it was already I didn't announced. read anything anywhere in my guesses. But I wonder if this was actually somewhere. I wonder. He he definitely did the lamest guesses, Swinney. We can we can slag. You reckon my guesses here. weren't lame? Mine were hundred percent made up, not no, based you're, on you're, anything. No, he said his is lame because they're really easy guesses. I guess yeah. Versus like your guesses were crazy. Like <laughs> Switch Pro. Why would up. they <laughs> announce a Switch Pro? Because we're in, going into the holiday season. People wouldn't buy the Switch anymore. Oh yeah, that's a fair point. I didn't think that. <laughs> so that makes it a really aggressive guess. <laughs> no ancient prophecy. But he's like four guys to What's the Switch. What's Disney Castle like, doing really? in this? Kind of four guys to the Switch. That's like anything to the Switch. That's a shit guess. Switch, switch, switch. You've got your back. I've got your back. Deep Dragon Age. That looks like the Disney Castle. Dark spawn. Yeah, it did look like it a bit. Even the Dread Wolf. Oh, the Dread Wolf. Of course. Wait, was that the dude from... Is your story. But wait, they've already Dragon done Age. trailers of Dragon Age, right? Surely they're going to have, like, gameplay. And... No, they're just re-announcing it. That's a really weird trailer. I felt like even the canned laughter was... Right, uh, canned back, clapping guys. was pretty lame. Hey, is that AR? I don't know what's going How do they on? do that? <laughs> Next, we'll have a look at an exciting what? new... It's like he doesn't even know what's going on. ...based roguelite game set in the Endless what Universe. The Here on? is another new game announcement. Roguelike. Do you reckon that's going to be a category one day? Best roguelike. Maybe. Best, so many best rogue -like. Metroidvania. Yeah. <laughs> Man, the interlacing, jeez. How, like, think about this, dude. Ten years ago to now, mm. game trailers. <laughs> like game trailers oh, yeah. are like art yeah. now, man. <laughs> like, I mean, look, they, no, they were pretty good even ten years ago. I reckon. Uh, not like my this. biggest, not like this. Uh, they were pretty good ten years ago. I think. No. I think the issue is more that now it's getting harder to actually distinguish between a trailer and not. Before you used to go, oh, that's definitely a trailer, obviously. Whereas now it's like, wait, that could actually be gameplay. Well, that was like before, right? But I, I I'm adamant. I think that the actual gameplay looked better than the trailer. Uh, depends on the game and stuff. I think a lot of trailers were really good. Oh yeah, no, no. Normally the trailers. Like if I think of games like Diablo 2 or something, they had normally crazy the trailers. trailers. Yeah, yeah. No, uh, did... like I don't know, dude. Because you know, as part of the uh, game of some other year, like 2011, I went back and watched all the trailers for those games. Ah. Uh, and yeah. they were like really lame. Like I was like, oh wow, these aren't uh. very good at all. And they were like the biggest games coming out as well. What is this game? I missed the It's intro. a roguelike. Um, oh, so like PC? I don't know what platforms. 
It's gonna be like PC and PlayStation 5. Oh, Switch? Xbox, okay, everything. Endless Dungeon Dot Game. Sega. Do, 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 do. All right, uh, Endless Dungeons, very cool. Our next world premiere comes from South Korea, Crimson Desert, the new open world action adventure game from Pearl Abyss. This next gen game this offers like in depth story driven single player content in an MMO oh, setting. Player. What you're about to see in includes setting? actual gameplay footage. So it's an MMO. This okay. is the beautiful and merciless world of Crimson Desert. So it is an MMO, not a single player game. Don't know. What did it say at the start? It went too quick. Actual in game. And it's actual in game footage. Or something. Still a work in progress, I think it said. A work oh, in progress. Okay. Wow, this looks insane. Looks pretty sick if that's in game. <laughs> yeah, like Flight Simulator <laughs> graphics. I know, right well, even maybe better. I mean, although it doesn't have the crazy monolith. The lighting's really good on this. I like it that they just know how good it looks, so they're just like showing the yeah, <laughs> the yeah. Land. I I'm keen to see what it what it is at character level as well. It's like just putting something on the table, boom. Yeah. <laughs> just walk away. <laughs> we know yeah, what it we looks made. pretty good. Yeah, the water looks a bit rough. But I mean, when The Witcher 3 was announced, it had this a similar sort of style in terms of the look with the uh, the type of rendering they used for their engine. But then when the actual game came out, it looked quite different. Oh, so okay. I hope it's not the same sort of thing. Because I remember that disappointed people a little bit. The way the game looks in the think previous the looks it looks so Oh, good. it still looks amazing. It's, yeah. it's a really good looking game. But the trailers were even better looking in that sense. Just more realistic in terms of the tone and stuff. This is like a really odd trailer. Yeah. <laughs> like it feels like a trailer that would normally have a totally different score. Yeah, like different score acting. and people will probably be talking as well. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like <laughs> odd to watch it, right? I think the awesome character animations look though. fine. Yeah, they look good. Oh, really good, yeah. The shivering. I gotta go check out South Korea. It's one of my top places that I want to go visit. Yeah, well, because, uh, you know, obviously the f part of the family's from Hong Kong, right? So we've got to go yes. eventually back to Hong Kong, like when things settle down a bit. So mm. we're going to do Hong Kong, Japan, and I would like to do South Korea. That, one, that looks really crazy. Did. See, this looks pretty rough, though. Kinda. I don't know. This looks good to me, though. I just don't like that kind of style of combat sometimes. It's assessing Creedy. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Sweeney would love it. Yeah, he'd absolutely love it. I, like, is there literally anyone who likes Assassin's Creed more than him? Um, I don't know anyone. I'm sure there are, but I don't know anyone. But I've never heard anyone on the internet being, like, a mega fan, you know what I mean? Like, if anything, people rip on Assassin's Creed a lot, you know? Like, ah, oh, the new games are better, they need to take a break though, blah, blah. He loves all of them, man. Hmm. He's 100% at all of them. Because they're all RPGs. I like the minimalistic interface. You can't see it now, but previously well, it just but you had a little know. bit. I know exactly, yeah. But like now, I feel like it's. Oh yeah. If they keep it something like that, it would be pretty cool. It's just very. I'm minimal. always a big fan of that, man. Same. I tend to turn like when I was playing Red Dead, I turned a lot of the stuff off. Just relied yeah, on. Dude, that game. The sun. I feel like no one talks about that game anymore. Been out for a little while, I suppose. Yeah, but like most people sort of played it and G GTA Five came out oh. on the PS3, right? And people, yeah, that, oh, that's that, because that's they a, keep I, playing I it and they play GTA no, no, Online yeah. and then it's come out a million well, Red Dead copies of it there's every Red year. There's a new Online. copy. I don't know. It just like it seemed like when that game came out, oh, everyone Dragon was sick. like, "This is the, this is a ten out of ten perfect game," right? Mm. And then when everyone did their like, "Oh, this is the best games of the PS5," Red Dead wasn't even on the top ten for a lot of people. Hmm, strange. It just seemed really strange to me. The art style and the the well, the sort of realistic really look in this is pretty broken, crazy. man. <laughs> oh, it's still. It was like progress, moving with but... no gravity. It was like bizarre. I'm just impressed by the graphics on this. 
Yeah, I don't know about that. That looked pretty rough. Thing. <laughs> the bricks falling out. Of no, but just the, the lighting is really good. The lighting. We'll work on stuff right. like that. The lighting is really good. In this. Is it just like the ray tracing or what? I don't know what. Probably. Die. Oh yeah. Speaking of ray tracing, uh, I'm I'm now stuck in this annoying. Well, annoying. First of all, problem of, do I play Cyberpunk at 1080p? with ray tracing and a bunch of stuff off or do I play it at 1440p with no ray tracing and a bunch of stuff on yeah but you missed the most critical thing what's the frame what? rate of those two setups well no that's what I mean like I would say in order to get roughly equal frame rate I would have to compromise either way so I'd have to run lower res I I'd go the smaller with ray screen. tracing I'm not going to go smaller screen it's just so immersive on the 32 well, inch then you've already answered the question <laughs> Well, no, I mean, I could still go the, that screen, just have a lower res. That's still fine. It's still usable. Nah, it's still fine. Nuts. That's nuts. It's just the kind of like, I feel like you lose that's wrong. a bit of the fidelity, even with you the get LSS. a 1080p 27 inch monitor. If you think I have a 1080p 20. Uh, that's what I'm watching this on. But I find like now, being on the 32, it just it feels, feels small. This year, the star of Tenet, John David Washington. Tenet. Hey John. Tenet. I haven't hey, seen that yet, so no spoilers, thanks. What, same, and it's also As coming you know, out, Christopher Nolan's like, streaming in a few Tenet days. Played a character called the protagonist. Very hey, you ruined it for me. Named narrative, and I thought that was cool. La 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 Great narratives. What is this setup? Is this his home setup? <laughs> it's got a black room. I doubt it. It's obviously a studio. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I should have so, done that. I should have, I should have not had light in the background. No, I think your setup looks alright. It's different to mine. I would not have I'm going to be fascinated to see what um, Swinney has eventually. <laughs> yeah. Should be interesting. Who do you reckon is going to win? What's the. Best narrative, I think it is. Best narrative. Surely it's gonna be Last of a Us. Reunion. So the Final Fantasy V, I've never finished the remake of Seven, but I'm gonna assume the narrative is similar to the original up to the that the point. Game award goes to the Last of Us Part Two. <laughs> of course. This game is gonna win Game of the Year, man. This is the first. Look, they don't even want to put like the good people out yet. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> like, let's, mm. that's the biggest sign. That's the biggest sign. Yeah. They've just gone, they've, so they've asked Jeff, come on, like, um, let's just map this out. Like, we want everyone to have a, you know, a shot. Director of the Last of Us cartoon, Neil Druckmann, who was courageous enough to tell such a ballsy story. Hey, don't, I feel like I'm going to get this bloody game spoiled watching this show. I wouldn't go so far as to say the story was ballsy, if you know what I mean. No, 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 there weren't many, no, no, no. There weren't I, many I, balls I, I, in the story. I know, I know, I know what you're joking about. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not dumb. So just a reminder, we've only got four categories left. Best oh, indie okay. game, best RPG. But by the way, best RPG is pointless because we all voted for the same thing. Okay, yep. So we've only got three categories where we could actually win or lose, and we're all on the same points. <laughs> okay. And and I'm feeling very good that I said Last of Us Wait, Part 2 for Game actually, of the Year. I thought you got in front with No, but then you got back. I can't believe it. You got How? the win. Oh, no, wait. Am I getting it wrong? No, I didn't. I don't think I did. I think you're Oh, fine. no, yeah. You're, you're, we've got three points. You've got two points. Oh, yeah. You're behind. You need a, you need a W. Hmm. Sammy chef, what the hell? You're in trouble actually because you said four what? guys, but so did Swinney. So if you get that, oh. he still stays one point in front. So you literally need to get all of your votes correct from now on. It's not gonna happen. My Swedish, it's a little rusty, but I think there's been a little bit of confusion, honestly. Hey, I used to know something about the Swedish chef. It was like something like when they translated uh, the Muppets into Sweden, they did it as Norwegian. Oh, okay. <laughs> like the, 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 the what he was saying. Wow. You're supposed to be sharing an announcement here about a co-op game. Wasn't he on the, the show last year for Untitled Goose Game? Don't I think he was on the Game Awards last year, Swedish Chef. Yes, that is for why Untitled you're Goose Game. World okay. Let's take a look. It's probably Untitled Goose Game 2. What the hell is this? 
It's Overcooked Swedish Edition. Is this Overcooked Swedish Edition? Overcooked 3. That'd be cool if it was. Undercooked. The prequel to Overcooked. Yeah, Undercooked, yeah. You gotta cook badly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, finally, a game I could be good at. Oh, what is this? All You Can Eat. And there Swedish you have it. Okay. So what's what just the character? Chef? I have no idea. If all you can just the characters, the announcement, that's one of the lamest announcements I've seen. <laughs> as much as I enjoyed the game, it's not exactly something I look forward to. Oh oh, 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 no. I don't know if that was intentional, that's awesome. <laughs> this time it's real. Swedish Chef is playable in Overcooked All You Can Eat on PS5 and Xbox Series. <laughs> I love the love that's <laughs> Yeah, it's awesome. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> you go Gal Gadot. You're like, oh wait, who who am I coming after? Oh, the Swedish chef. Yeah, the Swedish chef. Okay, great. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about his shoes. It's it's ruining the the, the aesthetics. Of the yeah, just, you know, they're just trying to get out there. A group of thinkers, dreamers, and pioneers who represent the dreamers. bold and inclusive future of video games. How do I get my setup to look like this? That like that guy. I don't know. A lot of lighting, really I guess. Good camera. Life, to be honest with you, my name is Roy. Better camera. You've I've got a good camera. Oh no, your camera's not that good, though, is it? No, no, my actual camera camera is great. It's fine. No, I checked it. This remember. isn't. You could get a cam link thing. Yeah, that's what I mean. I could use a cam link on that one. And no, but I don't think you can on yours, right? Because why not? Didn't I check it? Mm, I thought it had. You could, but there was like something. Yeah, that like. It's really annoying the way it works. It basically like the way that the cam links work. Mm. So far. They're taking just, just the really HDMI output open from the, the digital to come camera, as right? But they're not really built to do that. So some of them overheat if you have them on too long. Ooh, yeah. And then the other ones sometimes they have like little things <laughs> oh, over the top everyone. of the screen. Alana Pierce. Overlays. I'm Alana Pierce coming at you live. From Alana Pierce from man. Australia. As someone with a chronic yeah. Illness, hey, she's got the road thing like I do. To deal with it's not bad, by the way. Situation. You've got like maybe the Shaw SM7B. No, I've got the, the road. The, the yes. Oh, yeah, look at you. You're a streamer, man. You're a yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a full-on streamer. You're going to be like nominated for this category next year. I should be nominated. And then I can start, you know. Inhaling can actually worsen your anxiety and just kind of fight <laughs> what? against... Hey, boys! <laughs> ...this year. Not that I would know, because... You know... But that doesn't mean I'm not trying to look out for you. <laughs> for those of you who are looking to quit vaping, which I hope you are, This Is Quitting is a free text-based program with a free built-in support system. Text Game Awards oh, to She's telling me to quit vaping? How dare you? What? Test... What? This is... Oh, this is for to quit... What? To quit gaming? Uh, no, quit vaping. Oh, quit vaping. Yeah, there's like a... That's how they... You know, my mom, you can't tell me what to do. I don't vape. I do have a friend though who does, and I send him a lot of memes. Why? Mocking him. Oh yeah, it's not very cool. Like, I mean, cigarette smoking- I don't think smoking, it's cool at all, it's lame. It's cool, like, I don't like it, but it is cool, you can't argue it. it I don't think cool. it's cool at all, man. It doesn't oh, look really? cool at all to me. It no, looks not in your case, it looks not in your lame. personal- In your personal situation, yeah, I totally agree. It's not cool. It's very sad. Vaping <laughs> no, right. and smoking is just sad. I wrote a story about but all I'm trying to say is like, you know, the history of movies and stuff. Tonight, smoking looked cool. Oh yeah, it was. I can see, I used to think it was cool, man. Vaping never looked cool. Vaping always looked cool. Maybe never was a cool thing, though. And, like, in a bad way. I used to think smoking did look cool, don't get me wrong. You know, you grow up on believing stuff like that. Warframe. But I just think it's like what? now. Unreal Tournament? Warframe. Because they were, they were doing, like, a pre-alpha, right? <laughs> on Unreal Tournament. What? Are they Where actually they? This making is Warframe. This isn't... Wait, yeah, because there's just that ultra kill, and that's the thing oh gun. Yeah. Wait, are they introducing um, Unreal Tournament weapons into Warframe? I don't know. I'm really confused. Any casualties are enormous. Your Why are they just not making a new Unreal Tournament game? I know, right? It's weird. I mean, they got like trillions of the... dollars. Yeah, it's weird that they. Yeah, they haven't bothered. Man, people who are really into Unreal Tournament would be like devastated. <laughs> <laughs> like, really? the game awards earlier i asked you to head over to instagram to post our game of the year ar effects yeah i have to admit i didn't do check it out a couple of your creations 
Let's you not. jump on there and it'd be like, keep posting on Instagram and I'll share some more in just a bit. So now back to your host, Jeff yeah. Keeley. That, that, they're, they're like, they're the best two. Jeez. Thank you very much, Sid. Last month, Fair enough. Duty invited <laughs> imagine the person in the back room, like flicking through, going, oh my God, which one are we going to pick here? It's nothing. It's just dick pics. <laughs> for just people back. putting filters on their penises. Massive update, including like 300 gigabytes or something. Yeah. 300 gig download. <laughs> it is like almost farcical how how big the <laughs> updates are. It's ridiculous. Like, you know where they go, oh, <laughs> install four of these games will take up all of the PS5. It's like It that's would take ridiculous. up the yeah, it would. That's yeah. so ridiculous. I mean to be fair, I've only I've I've been playing on a 250 gig SSD on my consoles. So I'm used to only having a limited amount of space and having to delete stuff, but yeah. not everyone can kind of do that, right? You might have really crap internet, so good luck. It's really shit. Well, I went to upgrade. Well, what are you gonna do though, right? Like, let, let's also be fair. If you want a game to look the way it does, you know, I'm sure they already try to compress textures as nah. much as they can and Dude, they, everything they don't else. Care. They don't, they... Oh, I it's don't know. I reckon they do to some extent. Man. It's super unoptimized. I think. I think you know it's 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 some of the textures on on in games nowadays. It's insane. Yeah, but that doesn't it's mean obviously it's obviously not optimized. Space, space it's stuff like that. You can't tell me that a game needs to be like 300 gigabytes. No, like, it's not no games are 300 gigs. But I'm saying if you know there's like dude, a if you install there's a, there's a 50 gig stuff, update, like I can like see a, that. I think if you install like War, Warzone and all that other stuff with it, it's like 300 yeah. gigabytes. Something. Well, if you want 4K textures. I don't know. I'm, there's there's a limit to how much you can optimize there's that no stuff. No way it's optimized. I don't know. No that way. game is the way. The fact that that game runs so smoothly and it's always run really smoothly in every console means the game has actually been pretty well optimized for the consoles. Yeah. Optimized. Now, yeah, do they then I'm not spend not any time optimizing like its size? Yeah. No. That's what I'm saying. They don't. Care. Well, they would have to. As they would have to optimize stuff because otherwise it wouldn't run as well, would it? Because yeah, really if you've got massive textures. Right now. Wait, 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 I gotta see what this is. is. Yep. This is the most important thing. The 35th anniversary of Nintendo's is this the... classic Super Mario Brothers, originally released in 1985. Are they... Here, releasing a new Game & Watch with an alarm on it. It's a medley. I must Abbey listen. Road Studios in London. This is the world-class London Philharmonic Orchestra led by conductor... <laughs> what did I call it? Philharmonica? Does, does it keep stressing the Phil part? Phil, Philharmonica? It, well, I said it wrong last week. Philharmonica. It's Philharmonica, right? No, it's Is it Phil Philharmonica? Harmonica. Is it Phil with a harmonica? <laughs> You're an idiot. I have a harmonica. Do you want me to bring it? No, I've got one too. What is your what key is yours in? C. Oh. Mine's in B flat. Are you making that up? <laughs> no. I think it's. I G actually sharp. have a harmonica. I, could I got a not. harmonica as well. Okay. I got we should so bring music we should, we should jam. We should we should have we should surprise Swinney on this week's episode <laughs> just and just kick out a jam in the middle of it. Whip out our harmonicas. Whip out the harmonicas. Here's Whip my out other harmonica. things. Yeah, here's a here's it's my Phil, Phil harmonica. <laughs> it's called Phil. <laughs> this sounds really cool, man. I like how they're all distanced, like because of COVID now. Looks like a real baller, like orchestra, because they're so spaced yeah. apart. Does that change the sound signature at all? You reckon or not? It wouldn't really matter no, all that I don't much. Think so. But I think, like, surely they all should be wearing masks that aren't using instruments that need to use their mask. Because people are blowing in the trumpets and everything. Aren't they going to... Oh, they're in uh. a different room. Look, 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 the trumpet guy. Is uh. it... Are they in a different room? Are I was they? thinking I don't know. They're going to get them all sick, aren't they? I don't know. I, I guess. But, I mean, come on. Wait, wait, look, look. Are should there any instruments using your mouth? Look, there isn't. Look. Look at it. They've got them They're to not the in a side. different room. They're just like in a thing. Yeah. No, no, look and at that. Where are they? Where are they? I'm telling you, man. They're not in the main room. <laughs> I like how this is the most important thing of watching it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Finally, we're debating something properly. Look, look. Where is this guy? See, he's just. Well, I think the see? drummer lady was definitely in a different look, room. Dude, I'm telling you. Look at the instruments, like the like woodwind and everything. They're not in the same room. Look, see, see, they're separated. That's so weird because of the COVID thing, I reckon. Wait, and then they stitched it together. No, they 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 mic all of these instruments these days. 
Yeah, because where's the lady? I didn't see the lady at all. The drum lady. Well, the drums are too loud and they start to resonate. So they have to put them somewhere else, yeah. Yeah, they put them in a soundproof room for a drummer. Lots of shows still to come. Lots of us... Lots of shows right still now. to come, bloody hell. Normal tonight yeah, to see all these we're only halfway there, dude. <laughs> I know, it's so long. Yeah, I'm getting so tired. <laughs> you need more coffee, it must have been decaf. Well, until then, she probably did put decaf. Where you can do all of That's that evil. as you explore and record disappearing cultures in a strange, beautiful what? world. This game is just stunning, and it's coming to PlayStation 5. Check it out. Okay. Show it is there Jeff. any game that's coming to Xbox exclusively? Um, Perfect Dark. Perfect Dark. Perfect Dark was, yeah. yeah. But wait, they didn't say the time. Wait, that's in game? That looks sick. Is that, this is a trailer, right? Yeah, but that might be in game. Wait, wasn't that other game called Scavengers or something as well? The one at the start that we didn't think was too amazing looking? Yeah. What was that called? You mean the New Caledonia one? No, 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 no. The one, the. Fortnite looking. Uh, we'll have to start this again. Let's go from the start. Yeah, okay, how <laughs> <laughs> This looks really cool. But it's not in game, right? I reckon it's in game. This is pretty nuts if we this is in game. Season. This is like insane cell shading. Ooh, season. Okay, that's in game, right? Yeah, this is in game. This doesn't look as good. No, but that might, uh... Hmm, no, this just looks, yeah, this, in this is, in, yeah, look at that, that looks... I mean, this is game. obviously in-game, yeah. Yeah, man, the other one looked way better. That's kind of like bait and switch, man. Well, yeah, but it's within the same trailer. It's not like they're trying to bait you and then buy Yeah, but game. I think these days they normally have it at the bottom versus not representative of in-game footage Beautiful, that's whatever. seasons. All right, well, now it's time to present another... Maybe it was, She's just a cut here. Here. Game of game. Wonder Woman 1984, here is Gal Gadot. Gal Gadot. Hey, Gal. Wait, it's, he Thanks, just said Gal Gadot. Honored to be here at the Game Awards. How do you say her name? Lots Gal Gadot. Games are Gal Gadot. <laughs> I don't know. I'll ask Aviva. She. Deeper message. She might they know. They focus on subjects that can be historical, political, or deeply. Personal. I like her outfit. The games for All right, Impact let's keep it G-rated. No, I like the outfit. Let's pull I like the, the slider. Kind of the cyberpunk slider down <laughs> to the left. <laughs> <laughs> what did you put in this I, coffee of mine? Has, has that become a meme yet? Like someone sliding the slider to the right? Yeah, some people have done that. Oh, wait, is this the... No. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yes, this game. This that game's really cool. I... Is this Ben Cindy? What, Spiritfarer? John hated it. Yeah, Spiritfarer, that's gone. Really? Sweeney, Sweeney hated it. Oh. And our friend John hated it. Different guy. <laughs> yeah, they both hated it. <laughs> so, sometimes it's like they're almost the same person, but they're not. We guarantee you. No, totally different. To resist. Split personalities. Yep. Our games for impact. Spirit Farah will win. We didn't tell me vote why. for this. Oh, tell me why. So when you played that. Tell me why are we? Hello, I'm Lily Hall, the community manager of Tell Me Why. And on behalf nah, of the entire team. From Is it really like the light, the audio Xbox visual? Publishing, thank you so much for this award. No, it's and thank okay -ish. you so much for all the love that you've shown Tyler okay. and Allison and their journey. I'd like to express our team's deep Slightly. admiration That's for fine. all of tonight's nominees, especially those that have used their platforms to d tell stories about trans and queer people with sincerity and heart. Here's to a future where even more marginalized people can see themselves yeah, and their experiences. said that the way that they handle the whole trans thing is really like, life. thank you so, well so much. done. When in what, sorry? Tell me why. Okay, I haven't live. played it. Is, working. This is, is that the so cool to game that came? Uh, right, is well, that right made by the same people that did? Um... Game announcement for you. Check this out. Let's give me another correction. But yeah, go on. It's the don't nod people. The what? Don't nod. Okay. Now, what's that other game that? Hey, this looks like um. I have to look it up. I think that show from the eighties, Dark Crystal. It kind of does. Oh is my god, it's Vin Diesel. Diesel. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's time to go. Vinny. Uh, it's time to go. I took... I, t I took my... Uh, <laughs> my father-in-law's face and put it on him. Your father-in-law? That actually worked really well. He got married and didn't even know. You. <laughs> well, you know. You just, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Father -in -law you know what I mean. It's just easier. You took, you took the face of Vin Diesel? No, I oh, took <laughs> I took his face and put on Vin Diesel oh, in a bunch of movies. Is this this thing that you submitted all our images to? 
<laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> the that thing I submitted like... earlier images to. You're in some sort of database. Swinny was so now. pissed about that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he likes his privacy. That's why he's not on this. I thing. like my privacy as well. Yeah, which is why you're on this for the whole internet to see. Hey, hey, hey! I don't say what my name is. On this. All right, there, Bob. What is this game? I don't know, but it's got Vin Diesel in it, so I'm totally getting it. <laughs> it's kind of wild that it's got Vin Diesel, actually. It's like, but it's such an odd setting to have Vin Diesel. Yeah, because I just expect him to all of a sudden put it, put that down and just get into some V8 car and just run them over instead. You know what my theory is? I reckon they what? asked The Rock first. Oh, and he said no. They sussed it out, eh? How much would it be for The Rock? They're going, nah, forget about it. <laughs> that animation looked really bad, by the way. But he, I, I think he would, he would work well in a game like this. The Rock? No, I think he'd been Diesel. He'd oh, look okay. good in this. I mean, he does look good in this. I like the camera Ooh. effect. <laughs> the blood that. looks ridiculous. <laughs> looks so comical. I assume this is an in-game, right? <laughs> but then wouldn't, then wouldn't it be better than blood? No, I don't, I don't think know. Maybe be the real blood will end up being better. Look at it, look at it. It looks like weird. It's like stylish. Stylistic, I meant to say. Man, this is a long trailer. Mm. Watch out behind you, girl. So what world is that set in? Because it's obviously not the past. This is what it's like in Hawaii at the moment because of COVID. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's freaking dinosaurs like it'd be like these orc creatures are just bad enough look at the blood you see yeah what it's, I'm it's weird but i wonder if it's <laughs> it something so to do bad. with uh it looks like no, a nintendo 64 or something i wonder if it's the blood or the effect or it's something to do with the video because to me it's <laughs> i wouldn't call it choppy but it's like it's missing frames and stuff yeah that's what i'm saying it looks <laughs> it looks whack and the interlacing is really interesting too. And then at the end of it's going to go Zelda 2. <laughs> I'm going to go, oh, the best <laughs> game ever! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm just preparing the thumbnail. <laughs> Maybe it's a new Assassin's Creed. <laughs> That'd be mad. So when you'd be like, oh, the best <laughs> game ever! <laughs> Yeah, Vin Diesel. Woo! Oh, that's crazy. the Animus, right? That kind of looks like some sort of an Animus thing, yeah. <laughs> That'd be nuts if oh. it was. That'd be awesome. <laughs> this is like Lost in Time instead of Lost in Space. Santi Santiago. Maybe this is where in the world is come in San Diego. Oh, it's a simulation. <laughs> what? I don't know. Was that a simulation or something? Mm, looks like dinosaurs to me still. Maybe this is Jurassic Park 6. <laughs> <laughs> like the actual movie. Ark! 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 With Vin Diesel in it now. Ark 2! Damn, Ark 2. Uh. I love it. <laughs> okay, nice. That's pretty big, man, because people are really into that game. Yeah, that's right. Ark 2 starring. <laughs> I feel like he was Diesel, responding to me. Yeah. <laughs> has one more announcement <laughs> for all Ark fans. Check this out. Yeah, Vin Diesel's going to be in it. The balance of nature or they've like added him into the original there is someone out there who may change our yeah people smash this game dude like put thousands of hours into it it does look pretty good and it's not even a million dollar prize at the on the line strange we were. <laughs> i think most people are not going to put in millions of hours in that game that's for sure they'll uh, lose hey, straight away and bucks they would. what is this and they've got a netflix series no way really i guess we barely even know this game. <laughs> and then it's like... There'll be toys and stuff coming out of it as well, this right? It's gotta be Netflix, right? Is that Shredder? Waiting for the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. To yeah, yeah, exactly. Come it's out. a crossover arc. <laughs> Cross with. <laughs> oh, the blood looks still looks crazy. Yeah, that must be a feature of the original game. 
good boy. Yeah. It'd be funny if you're like a huge because Vin Diesel's not in the first game, the Ark game. I don't think so. So that's the animated series, okay? Cool. I just feel like there's gonna be some people out there who hate Vin Diesel but love that game and put thousands of hours into Ark, and then it's like yeah. Ark Two with Vin Diesel. <laughs> with Vin Diesel. <laughs> well, he might not actually end up being in it. It might just be they're Carl using Urban. it as a. Huh. Oh, he's in this. Oh, Russell wow. Crowe, Vin Diesel. What? Wow. <laughs> Wait, what is what is it showing on? Well, that's probably the tie-in, right? It's because they're probably doing the animated series, or they're voicing the animated series. So then they just had him in the trailer. Oh wait, Swinny might be right. Four guys for Switch. Here we go. He could get it. This is Swinny. <laughs> I'm almost gonna cancel him out if it doesn't say on the Switch. Uh, I it would you. would be. Canceling, yes, it's got to be on the switch, right? If you get it correct, because you can't see the video at this stage, if you get it correct, I put winner winner chicken dinner. <laughs> and if you get it wrong, it says you died. <laughs> <laughs> so, Swinny, you're on the line right now with your lame guess. Have you actually played this yet? No, I want to, but... Same. People have fallen off this game like crazy. Fallen off is like... in the game or fallen off is in? Yeah, not playing it. I don't think it's like... There's not a huge amount of people playing it anymore. Mm, okay. I think it's like one of those games... It's quite interesting. I read an article from the people that made it. They really were inspired by Rocket League. And I think the problem with this game is... Like, once you've played it a bit, like, even, you know, I'm saying, like, 50 hours. Mm. <laughs> a bit, I'm really yeah, sure if it's, like, the kind of game that you'd go, like, consistently back to. Mm. Just because, like, the way it's built, the RNG, everything like that. I don't know. I don't know. Here we go, here we go. Is there anything about Switch? Nothing yet. Just Season 3. The whole season thing to keep people glued right. and interested. Do you, do you reckon I should call it and say he's failed? He's failed. Yeah. Device, uh, no <laughs> switch. All right, you died, Swinny. So Swinny's got you can play all new Sakaguchi right, next, game. The guy made Final Fantasy. And the award for best New Wolfenstein game. And later, we've got You've got Ragnarok Keanu trailer, Reeves, Xbox, Switch Jam, Pro. Playing his song from The Last of Us Part Two, but right now. Ah, I told you, Last of Us Part 2! Oh, is he playing from that? Wow, yeah. that's cool. Ooh, really dangerous, cool. I have I mean, a copy this, of that on every platform and I just This show it. is too long, right? Like, it is seriously it's too long. massively long. Yeah, but the, people can say <laughs> that about the podcast as well. Three hour long podcast, are you oh, guys damn. crazy? I love the music, man, what the hell? Yeah, this is cool. I was like smashing this song the other day, man. <laughs> it's like so bizarre. I'm like watching this now. This is cool that they've done this now. I was actually playing this for my kid. <laughs> I was trying to explain to him like, the structure of it. Finally, a version of this, the sim that I can actually play, unlike. Oh, actually, no, I haven't installed, uh, wait, did I? No, I haven't installed Star Citizen yet on the new machine. I gotta see how it runs. Because, wait, um, Bethesda has got, like, a space Skyrim, right? What was that, that called? That was one coming out, yeah. What was that called? I don't remember. So this looks pretty cool. Man, Swinny would be going crazy right now. Starfield, that's what it's called. Right, that's it. Oh, early 2021. Hmm. Never. Yeah, See, it's never. good that they say early. It should be like early, mid, late. <laughs> Not <laughs> summer true. 2021. To be honest, with all the delays and everything like that, that's is probably that the best way to do it. Wellington? No. Yeah, that, it said it at the bottom. Wellington. Oh, it did. Okay. <laughs> you idiot. I swear to God, I didn't see it. I know you didn't, because you would have been even dumber if you said recognized it. that after you saw the thing said Wellington. In mental health specifically, something clicked. I realized I liked that it. It was as windy as they said it would, but I really like Wellington. Video games yeah, she's like, oh my life. Way of nurturing Splunky my is the best game ever. <laughs> and I wondered if I could do that too. Hi, this is Dr. 
and so well you know there's like art therapy yeah there, maybe there's a video game therapy the gaming oh, it probably is yeah i think games could be very therapeutic i think they are very therapeutic for people well, definitely especially if you're on the spectrum and all that kind of stuff to provide real tangible resources to people who are struggling that they can use in their everyday life Above all else, I want people to I like know this lady. that I might it's this okay up to be struggling at the moment. There Checkpoint. are resources out there. That's a good name for mental health. And it will get for like mm. gaming checkpoint. Good. Welcome good thing. to Enoch. I tip my fedora. I mean, I love that. Wait, that was a Facebook thing. What's the uh, Facebook gaming? I don't know. Sponsoring. It was, but I just I'm so cynical when I see that. <laughs> Why? You reckon well, it's like it's like money? BP doing a, an ad for how they help climate the environment. Same sort of thing. Oh uh, yeah, on climate change or something. Same shit. Well, I think I think it's true to say BP. I think they spend the most amount of money in the world promoting climate change and for like awareness, climate change awareness. Yeah. <laughs> Which is but, like, uh, it's so hypocrisy. Smart. The strategy. Yeah, it works on, you know, the average person maybe. Not even the average person. I think even the average person is very cynical about stuff like that. And it just shits me. What is this game? If I give one critique to... to, uh, to Jeffy Boy... Hmm. Besides the shoes. No, nah, I'm, I'm fine with the shoes. That's not... Mm, I don't know. He, he can do what he wants in that space. Yeah, yeah, I know, but it's a little out there. It ruins the aesthetics of the rest of the show. <laughs> I don't mind. Mm. My, my suggestion to him, he's got to think about, like, the pacing of the show. You know? It's like Do way, you think it's one... him that actually does that, though? Or does he have uh, people who do pacing? 100%. 100%. I reckon, I reckon yeah. there's people who, who do that. Like, I mean, he'll have a say in it, but I reckon there's people he, who are actually in charge it, of it. He is doing it, because you can see it's like, you have a really action-packed trailer, and then it's like a very, like, slow trailer for the next one. Hmm. Hey, this looks cool. But he needs too much breaks. It's almost, like, too frenetic, the whole show. It's just like... Too frenetic? Bah, bah, bah. Frantic? Too frenetic. What's frenetic? Like, it's too much, too much action, too many things thrown at you. Frantic? Frenetic? How do you spell this? I don't know how to spell anything. Frenetic. You mean frantic? No, frenetic. frenetic. Like, I, I literally don't have my phone on me. Google okay. it. I'm not saying but it isn't a word. I just never heard of it. Careful for spoilers. <laughs> we're like... Careful for spoilers. <laughs> we're like two hours into this. Frenetic. Frenet... Frenetic. Forged in Shadow Torch. That's kind of... Whoa. Frenetic. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Frenetic. You missed it. The, g the game is called Forged in... Shadow Torch, and Forged then they the spell Torch it out. Fist. <laughs> it's called there's fist. no, there's no word, there's no word called frenetic. Yeah, dude, there's a word called frenetic. Frenetic? Ah, oh, frenetic. F F R E N E T I C. Fast and energetic. Are you and missing out on your, your PC stuff? You love I'm sorry. This. Okay. I love this shit. I do love this stuff. Ryzen, you're Ryzen right now. What? <laughs> I'm, no, I'm not because I have no idea what they just announced. What was that? I wasn't was even a, looking. Uh, what is it called? Hey, what's uh, up, guys? It's uh, Tom Holland here. 4080. I'm in Atlanta on the set of the next Spider-Man. 4080. Yeah, yeah sure. Nvidia 40. <laughs> yeah, the AMD 4080. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, you know what? We just can't make enough of the 3080. So we're just going to release the new one. You have a pre-order for 2025. <laughs> I might have to get a 3080 just so I can actually get Cyberpunk too. <laughs> I like. Uh, I might have to. Hey, so you don't reckon it will run under 2060? Oh, no, no, dude, it'll run perfectly fine. That's not a, that's not a question, but you're going to have to make some compromises if you want to get ray tracing on. I love compromises. It's called waiting a year until they optimize the game. It's called being married. <laughs> and then I don't or have to that. anymore. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> Maybe I'll just wait. When someone searches for Nathan Drake on IMDb... And hey, it's Nathan Drake. Result, ...I will only be remarkably bitter. You know, video games allow <laughs> us to connect with friends, family, and complete strangers. We can share memorable experiences beyond the confines of our own homes, or even travel to vast mm. new worlds with what our are, buddies what are, on the What is he going to present? Of all the years I've been great um, for multiplayer Uncharted games, they've never five? been more important to us than they were nah, in no this way. historically crappy, rotten, no-good, cursed year. 
These are the nominees. I don't know. The Best year multiple. hasn't been that bad for some Best people. Best multiplayer. Best I, find, multiplayer. I find that hard. Presented by Instagram. Oh, hey, this is a category for us. We, uh, Among it Us. Is, yeah. You and I said Among Us. Yes. And Twenty said Warzone. So hopefully he he gets it wrong and we get I it right. I still don't think that Animal Crossing's technically a multiplayer game, but okay. Oh no, nah, don't. I totally disagree with you. It's like some people are like super into the multiplayer stuff. Nah, yeah, but nah, dude, seriously, some what can you like, actually really do in the multiplayer it, context? It might be like, one of the biggest too. multiplayer games this year. Yeah, but what do you do in the game other go, than trade Among shit? Us. Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Well, at least I'm ahead of John. Well, you don't I mean, want to Swinney, lose points. You don't want to but... lose points. Thank you so much. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, look, they're excited. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, I can do this. All right. <laughs> wow, they all have to wear masks <laughs> still. Who voted for us. Where are they based? Um, also, congrats to all the other games nominated. Um, they must be in Victoria. <laughs> Our goal among us from the beginning was to create a fun experience amongst friends. Uh, so among uh, us friends? I'm on, I'm on four uh, votes. Yeah, I'm on you three. You guys are on three votes. Both okay. of you are on three. Cool. And there's only two actual categories left because so we all voted for Final Fantasy for best RPG. With friends and family. No, we didn't. Oh wait, did we? Yes, we did. Yeah, Final Fantasy. Oh yeah. And our other partners for helping us navigate all day. Is she crying? Yeah. Thank you to our moderators and the fans. Damn. You know, there is a chance that if you guys get the best indie game, Fall Guys, that we'll all be on the same points. So then it literally comes down to game of the year. That's awesome if that happens. I'm kind of almost hoping that happens. Tonight you've been using Instagram's. I'm gonna be really unpopular here and say I was really underwhelmed by Among Us. I think we just yeah, didn't play same, it properly. Yeah, same, dude. I bought it, and I'm like... Well, I, Swinny was so into it, and I'm like... Uh, this yeah, game's just like... Later. It's just like the German right, board so games that we play. Yeah. yeah. Card games. But not as good, actually. I prefer it in person. Same. Yeah, I feel like... I don't know, maybe we didn't play like, it or... I don't know, but yeah. No, no, I, I'm telling you, this is what it is. People haven't played those games, man. Those tabletop games. Maybe that's why, And this is like their first introduction. And when I first started playing those tabletop games, I'm like, oh, these are awesome. Hmm. I feel like it's something like that. I don't know. For some reason, Saber I don't think I'll get any of my predictions correct. Well, I got half a point for the Smash Brothers thing. Actual pre-alpha in-game footage. Where does this pre-alpha word come from? I don't know. There's no such thing as pre-alpha. Is it a new thing? I don't know. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Is this Evil Dead? This is Evil Dead, dude. It seems is an archaeologist oh, this is awesome! To Holy moly, this is Evil Dead! It was never meant for the world of the living. The oh, this is so sick, man! Dark in the woods. I love Evil Dead so much. I didn't, I didn't think you know. I freaking love I Evil Dead. I don't, but yeah, it definitely is. And then it came oh, this is sick! What is this? <laughs> for me. This Multiple is so cool. Evil Dead. Oh, this is so cool, man. I'm so playing this game. It actually does look pretty cool. I don't even care if it's trash. <laughs> I just love Evil Dead. It doesn't look too bad though. What's it, it coming out of? It's coming oh, out. It's on even Switch. coming on Switch. <laughs> it's coming out on everything. I'm getting That's it on not going to be. Yeah. I'm getting on PC. <laughs> yeah, same. Is being remade. Take a look at this announcement. Remade okay. Super Metroid, man. Is it? Is it? Dude, I will lose my shit if Super Metroid <laughs> got remade. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Show Samus is. Whoa, whoa, no way. Ah, uh, damn, I got oh, excited for a sorry, second. It's Capcom. I got, like, so excited. Oh, dude, Ghosts and Goblins. It, uh, Holy yeah. moly. <laughs> this is cool. I love this game, man. I'm just trying to tell if it's. Yeah, it's Ghosts and Goblins. Oh, you can play in your underwear, that's cool. I think I prefer. Yeah, that's part of the original game. I think I prefer the original game graphics. I know that's yeah, good. it's it. I agree. This actually, this is kind of unique though. This is it, it's like a storybook. No, yeah, it's coming out soon. Like an illustrator storybook. That's a very unique art style. Yeah, but like the original. I don't know if you've seen. Nah, it. I know what Check you mean. it out. I know it what looks you mean. so good. The original. Oh, yeah. here we go. Here we go. This is what I want to play. <laughs> it might have one of those modes what where you can this? switch between the art styles, maybe. Capcom Arcade. What is that? Current Kate Stadium. Oh. Damn, I get dude. Maybe it's it's all, it's all their pokey gaming. I know. Oh, no, no, that's um, that's Konami. In the category Does Capcom don't do that too. Game, oh wait, wait, wait. This is this is a key category, man. Oh, best in here, we go. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. 
If you okay, so I went Hades and you went Fall Guys. If I get Hades, you guys are in massive trouble. Well, you'd probably win then, wouldn't you? Oh, nice. Nice. Damn. I think it's GG's, bro. GG WP. Resident Evil 3 and The Last of Us Part 2. And our winner is Doom. No, Last of Us. Last of Us is destroying it, dude. Oh, yeah, we all said Final Fantasy. Oh, yeah. I should gamble on it. I should gamble on it. 3 rents so bad. For me. Final uh, we all got it. Yeah, yeah, of course. We all got that one. But that means you're in the lead by one now, right? Uh, two, I think. Two. Damn. <laughs> With one category left. <laughs> uh, best sim. Flight simulator. Surely. It's got to be flight sim. And the winner is Microsoft Flight Simulator. Of course. Congratulations. Of course. And in our fan category, player well, Ghost, choice, we already know this, right? Yeah. They did say it already. You know that um, Last of Us was in front for ages. Oh. And then I think all the haters got on board and were like, nah. And the winner, as you may know, we announced it online. Congratulations. Yes, we do know, Jeff. That's cool, Shiba. Ghost. Well deserved. So we could end the stream here, man. I'm on six points. You guys are on four. Okay, yeah, what's the point of watching the rest, right? <laughs> Dude, I have to say, because I know you can't see me. I was yeah. like about to lose my shit. <laughs> Like, I thought it was like, for a second, it was a Super Metroid remake for a second. I was like, damn, what? <laughs> oh, man. Because I'm not in a game. Oh, come so. on. You were oh, it's Karate Kid. Karate Kid for Nintendo 1987. And your karate was weak. I've been watching that recently. Listen, this is so whatever. weird. Cobra Kai. Just read yeah. off the list of nominees, huh? Best it's, it's exactly how you'd expect it, and it's ridiculously predictable. Mortal Kombat 11, yeah, I don't Ultimate. think I'd like it. Yeah, I, it's, everyone loves it's not, it, I, I don't think it's One weird. It's like, man, it's supposed to, up. it's supposed Under to sort of, you know, cater for the nostalgia, but I feel like it's aimed go. at the game award. more teenagers. Two. Mm. Sorry, it's, it's stuck. <laughs> Somebody glue this thing? <laughs> I got you, Macho. <laughs> and the winner what? is Mortal Kombat 11 Ultimate. Nice. Congrats, nice. guys. Awesome. What was the uh, category? Right, uh, congratulations to Mortal uh, Kombat. It was the best fighting game. game. One of the things I have really oh, okay. uh, been missing this year is <laughs> no, the best world, fighting game. That's why I was Karate Kid guy. Beautiful games of right, of course. <laughs> like I go best, best family game. Mortal I didn't Kombat. Kombat. <laughs> Mortal Kombat, Kombat 11. Kombat 11. <laughs> to either that or you, so. Oh, thanks, dude. Here's thanks, dude. Oh, <laughs> what this I knew. This I knew was going to happen. So that should what? that should make your X Xbox just completely what, what, heat up. What did you think would make happen? Completely melt your Xbox. Oh, that is coming out on Xbox Series X. I assume it's going to be on Series. This X, is yeah. this is like this is like the killer app for Xbox now. Yeah. Oh, it's such a such an amazing game. Oh, it's insane. I want to get Okay, this is this is cherry picking locations and stuff, but still, it's an amazing game. I want to get this game for my dad, man, cuz he loves flying. It's really cool, but he needs a relatively beefy computer for this. No, no, no. This is but this is on Xbox Series X. They're showing it. This is what it looks oh, like on Series yeah, X. Yeah, Xbox. That's true, that's true. Dude, it's so it's so accurate in the sense that I managed to f take off at airports and find <laughs> Three of the homes I've lived in in the past, in different countries, completely different locations away from airports and everything. <laughs> it's that accurate that you can actually find it. I remember hearing this person, it's like, oh, I gotta fly from Melbourne to Sydney. <laughs> it's like in real time. I mean, you can, like, I've done that. I know, I know. It's I mean, that only out. takes an hour and a bit, Summer. so that's an easy one. But so yeah. that's, that's winter for us. That's, so that's in six months time. Q3, Q3. Yeah, six months. Q3. All right, uh, well, summer, so yeah. Start of summer? End of summer, who knows? Why don't they just say so mid-2021? <laughs> Why is it so hard to say mid-2021? Maybe, maybe the rules should be early, mid, late. Yeah, early, mid, late. And then you can go mid to early. You yeah, know what I mean? mid to early, like, exactly. Mid to late. Why is it so hard? Then you've got more categories. Yeah. <laughs> and you and don't have not, to be fixed you know, to not, you know, hemisphere centric. Hey, wait, what's this? This is my Kojima prediction? Maybe. It looks like PT. I know, I know, man. I'm on fire tonight. 
How is Mark You know that's not a Kojima <laughs> thing. What are they making? Oh wait, I have seen this. I've seen the preview of this already. Oh, okay. It's kind of like Dead Space sounds, meets sounds like um. The sound. The music's doomish. <laughs> Super. But this is this is like uh, Dead the, Space do, meets. Uh, do, do. Uh, what's that? What's a game that was set on that icy world? Um, and then it'll go lost. Do, 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 do. And then she turns into the Doom guy. <laughs> it's true. No, this turns out to be the new Metroid, dude. Because. Yeah, this is Metroid Prime 4. I mean, this is Metroid an amazing Prime game. Prime, yeah. I know yeah. I didn't say it earlier, but this is just amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Returnal. Another Returnal, okay. Interesting premise. I'll be... I can't believe there's like another the hour games of, like. of this. I know. <laughs> gotta like, deal what? with and this for no another other hour in a bit. We've only got one category left. Reggie! Hey dude, it would be awesome if he'd come out he's ready for him. Mother 3. Do you know about the whole Mother 3 stuff? What about it? So, do you know Earthbound? Yeah. Yeah. So Earthbound, which is Mother 2, mm. came out... It's the only one that came out in America, but it didn't come out in Australia. And they went out and made Mother 3, but then they only released it in Japan. <laughs> they never translated ah, okay. it. So they've hmm. got it there. People have translated it. What Interesting. You do with and it does seem strange they've never released it. My answer to this question used to be simple. What's it's this? So Is this Rainbow new... Six? Yeah, I feel. I feel like it's Rainbow new Six. Seems Rainbow Sorry. Six. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I, I reckon I'd get super addicted to that game. No, mm, I played it. It's not. I don't know. It's. Oh, you didn't like it. I didn't mind it, but I think if you had friends to play it with and stuff, otherwise it's not really. The thing I struggled with it. So with Rocket League, you play and then you're like, "Ah, oh, Rogue Company." Rogue Company, what's that? With Rocket Is that League. Another? Yeah, it's just another one of those types of games. Okay. Yeah. Ah, Super Meat Boy. What is it called? Forever or what? This game has been in development forever. Development or as in... Oh, it's new Meat Boy. Well, there's a sequel coming out. I think it's called Super uh, Meat Boy huh. Forever. It's like half procedurally generated or something like that. Interesting. It's been developed for Super Meat Boy. Because the first one was handcrafted, Yeah, Super Meat Boy Forever. Yeah, yeah, oh, 100%. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. So it's coming out in a few weeks. Holy hmm. moly. I'm hey, it's another Zelda-inspired game. Yeah, this is one I was telling being you. Being able to float off the, but this isn't the one I was thinking of. There's yeah, another I, one that I'm thinking you're of. You're talking about Phoenix Immortals Rising. I don't know if it's Google it. Phoenix Immortals okay. Rising. It's the worst name. This game looks pretty cool, man. I like. I was gonna install it. I got so close to installing it, and then mm. I found out it does a root kit on your PC. What? Yeah. And uh, no, it wasn't Phoenix Immortal Rising. It was a different game I'm thinking of. Really? Oh my yep. god. Different I game. It's like a, it's, you have to explore and you have to go from island to island and... See a thieves? No. No. Don't I'll have to look it up. I don't know that many games. But it, it's definitely got that very heavily Zelda inspired. Genshin Impact. Hi, I am Mary Mauser, what was that ad for? I don't even know. The game. But like the this game's already out. Versus Ellie from the Last of Us Part Two. I am Team Ellie. Ellie is probably one of the greatest game characters of all time. Man, yeah, this whole thing is just trying to spoil this game for me, man. Team it is. What? Have yeah, these two even played the game, or is it just advertising? Oh, 100 percent they played it. They loved the series. Well, Ellie mm, is an artist and a beautiful singer. Abby could be a good singer. You don't know. Yeah, you can tell she's not a good singer. Point collectors don't make good singers. Fair enough. You win this round, Roger. I mean, I must just, <laughs> I gotta say, mm -hmm. like, the Game Awards is just like a whole series of trailers <laughs> back to back, right? Well, that's With what brief, it is, yeah. brief interruptions to go, oh, and this is, yeah. this is one Oh, this one. is the one blah. <laughs> and, and it's basically a giant... Do, do you think to get onto this, you gotta pay money? No. You don't? No, no, no way. It's not a form of advertising to get onto. I, I mean, I, I'll, I'll say this. To put your trailer on, I mean. I'll say this. In ten years' time, maybe. But not yet. 
No, because I think his strategy, Jeff Keighley, just my view, yeah. he wants to turn this into like the the Premier. Game Awards. And I think it's already Well, it is hashtag that. the Game Awards, so yeah. No, but he's, I think that's also a, a, a reason trying. why he called it that when it changed from like Spike TV's yeah, you know, yeah, Game Awards or whatever. I think he wants to turn it into the Ashes. Oh, sorry, mm. the Oscars for gaming. And then he be the center, is. you know what I mean? So, yeah. I think it's too long, though. they got to make it short, I mean. But, I mean, the Oscars go for, like, three hours as well, so... I suddenly feel like buying a uh, HP Omen. Omen, baby. Omen, baby. Whoop, whoop. Omen, baby, buy it now. Buy, buy, buy. <laughs> Omen.com. Next week, I'll be decked out with we're Omen stuff. Yeah, we're, we're sponsored by Omen, we should say. <laughs> hashtag ad. Hashtag free hashtag product. Free. Yeah, hashtag please send some. We'll talk about it. <laughs> hashtag we'll give you our souls. Hashtag we're Omen boys. Yep, hashtag I will marry that laptop. Just send it to me. Right. He's not a fan of the Oscars. At his next Who game. isn't? Here Jeff. Is my buddy. He really is my friend, Joseph Ferris. Hey, Joseph. Joseph Ferris, this guy. What's up, Jeff? So what nice the? <laughs> yo, yo, yo. As you can see, I'm in the middle of a mocap shoot. Worth oh, this is the guy who was swearing at the start of the game. At the, ah. the game awards. He's like, F these, F the Oscars. <laughs> wow, awesome. <laughs> Everyone's like, oh my god. variety of gameplay never done before. And today, we're going to have a gameplay reveal. A word exclusive. I know oh, you like right. word exclusive, but this one is. <laughs> I like word exclusives. Anyway, we also. It's a word exclusive, and it's like the F word. Out. We call a friends pass, which means you buy one copy, you get one copy for free. You know. Oh wow. You play with your friend, cool you can concept. Play with free. With free. With, for free, I mean. <laughs> with free. Anyway, <laughs> out, I like this guy. He's, he's uh, yeah. charismatic, he, you know. He seems genuine as well. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, he, yeah. he doesn't read scripts. They, he just. You gotta, you gotta go back and watch him. You gotta watch more of Game of Wars. <laughs> um, yeah, you gotta watch him when he introduced it. He just started swearing and okay. just going nuts. I was like, what? Wow. And it was right at the start of the show as well. <laughs> wow. Like, I like that guy's energy, but this game, I'm not vibing it. It's no Evil Dead the game. This feels like the kind of game that I, I think I'd, I'd like to play with my girlfriend. I feel like you, every game, you go- wait, wait, wait. Are you like that uh, soccer player that goes, oh, I'd like to thank my wife and I'd like to thank my girlfriend? <laughs> no, 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 I just think this would be a perfect game to play with her. No, just I'm just saying you called her your girl, your girlfriend when you called her your wife before, so... She's, not, she's my girlfriend, she's not my so wife. You, you but obviously it, have... It feels like she's my wife, yeah. I feel like I have the same obligations. But you have a wife and a girlfriend. And this, she's got the same grip on me that... <laughs> Whoa, I don't need to know about this. <laughs> Yeah, my wife. Unless it's Animal Crossing, she doesn't want to play a game. <laughs> wow. She's putting nah, like four or five hundred cool. hours. She plays different things. Five hundred hours. Something like that. I could check it now. What do you do? Have they have they added a lot of content since? Hey, there's a lot of things to collect. There's oh god, the so that's all shirt. it is. It's just collection. There's the blue shirt. There's oh, the, the green shirt. shirt? Wait, do they have the yellow shirt though? No, only on a uh, Sunday, the green shirt, between 3 and 6 p.m. Oh, between 3 and 6 you get a green shirt, wow. Yeah. Dude, that's... I don't know, I just... yeah, wow, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so much other thing... so many other things to do in life. You know what's but funny hey, about all of this? Whatever. I feel like our main podcast on Sunday is going to be so long. You reckon why? Because we're talking about this so stuff. So many announcements and so many things. Yeah, that's true. But a lot of this stuff we won't even talk about. Like, we're not going to talk about the games we have no interest in, hey, I think. Hey, We're going to be talking you about will. this game. You tell me the name of it. I don't even know the name of this game because I haven't seen the <laughs> intro. I'm not saying it's a bad game. This could be a cool game. It's called Cool Gadgets Co-op. Cool Gadgets Co-op, it's called. See, again, this game would be great playing with... Uh, could be. With a Viva. You know what? In Can fact, I, I think I probably will get this actually. You know how I'm telling you, oh, telling the audience uh, game ideas? Uh, yeah. Someone so needs to can... have a game idea where it's like, it's asynchronous co op, where it's like, there's one player who's the good player, and mm. then the other player is not so good at games. Because I want to play games with my kid who's not going to be that good. What? 
an absolute crazy you know what I mean? Yeah, I want him to be able I to help out a bit. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. like, but he's not going to like kill me if he dies. You know what I mean? Yeah. So they kind of just they're helping. Press some buttons that don't really even do anything. Yeah, but does something. Like, just yeah. does little like, things. Some fireworks are selling on the screen. <laughs> yeah. He's been back every year since. We weren't going to let the streak stop this year. The retired president. Who is it? He's coming back. From Nintendo of America. Reggie. Oh, Reggie. Our dog. He's been on every single one. Our dog. I think he's the only one who's on every My single one. My buddy is ready for you to enter. Good, Reggie. Take it Look at him. He's like a gamer. He's got a gamer Absolutely. headset on. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, you'd hope he is. If he's got like a webcam, role. he's like full on gamer. Yeah. <laughs> he's got some. Are those amiibos or something in the in the back? <laughs> it's a custom amiibo of him. Oh. In a water. Sick. I know my amiibo. <laughs> Nintendo DS, and now you've got more of a gamer setup than he does. Today, <laughs> I've got more of a gamer setup than any of these people. My gamer setup is kind of lame, actually. I've got... Yeah, you, I, I don't, you can't see it, but hang on. Let me show you my gamer setup. Hang on. I've gone full gamer I'll setup, and now. you've got a minimalist. <laughs> By the widest and most inclusive audience possible. Because gaming is for everyone. Here are the nominees. Can you hear me? Check out this giant paperweight. Oh, that bad boy. When was the last time you turned it on? Uh, judging by the thick layer of dust on it, I don't know if you can see. <laughs> oh, man. It's been a while, yeah. People would hate you. I know, I'm sorry. I legit am sorry. It's I just, been like at least two weeks, I reckon, since you turned it on. It's probably been about two weeks, actually, yeah. Hey, hey don't let it fall. Right. Uh, hey, that looks cool, man. Why didn't you have that up there all day? I should have just had that on the whole time, yeah. <laughs> but but wait, I gotta sit more this way. Because I don't want to advertise crap for Sony. Imagine if I just drop it right now. No, to the left, to the left more. To the left more. More to the left? Oh, yeah, you can't see it now. Hey, look at this. This is creepy as hell. Look at this shit. <laughs> What is this? From everyone at Naughty Dog, thank you so What is going on here? Us so weird. Is that his partner or is that just like this is like when a beaver walked into the room, she had no idea what I was doing. What is oh no, she's actually okay, she's in it. What is, what is, why are they doing this? Designed and advocate for accessibility in our games. Well, I don't want to laugh just in case there's some kind of like accessibility reason why they're doing this. Developers, we know how one small design decision can unlock be. the entire game for a player. Games are special for their ability to blur the this lines. This is really odd though, sorry. Providing a means for personal engagement with narrative that is unrivaled in other Dude, parts Dude, Last of Us is winning game of the it's year, god. It's up to God. us to ensure that everyone is. can experience that for themselves. Mm. We'd like to thank our terrific group of I mean, it's winning so many awards. And we absolutely could not have done it without your, your insight. It's winning new your, awards. Your uh, detailed feedback. Are <laughs> you here. looking at the PlayStation 5? We'd also like to thank our partners at World Maybe. Studios. Looks um, cool. Our senior background. producer, Sam Thompson. That's all, that's all your PlayStation 5 is now. Team, Haven't you put the stand on it? Accessibility QA oh, it's somewhere. And you don't actually need like it. <laughs> if, you know, you're not going to tip it over. I feel like someone in the audience is like hating you so hard right now. You don't even have the stand. I'm going to use it. Dust just, on. I have work and stuff. Haven't you like, you know, gone back to Demon's Souls? No, I haven't since that was the last game I played on it. Wait, is that text message again? No, again, it's not me, dude. But you heard it, right? I heard it. Yeah. Wow, crazy. Thank you. It's Neil Druckmann. That's how he's sending text. He's sending code. Yeah, probably. Shut hey up. Hey, man. Hey, man. We won Get Game of the Year. Hey, man. We won Why Game of the Year. Presenting from the window. <laughs> it's like Russell Crowe or something. This next world premiere gives us our first glimpse at next year's big adventure for the Elder Scrolls Online. Enjoy. Oh, Elder Scrolls Online. Just show the non online games like <laughs> Elden Ring. Bethesda soft. That's not in game either, is it? By the way, soft works. It's such a weird like. Soft works. Yeah, hard works sounds better. <laughs> Hardcore works. I've heard that Fallout seventy six has uh, improved a lot though. Oh, I'm sure it has. Yeah. I, I played a little bit. I actually bit personally of that. didn't mind just playing by myself. When it well, first came out. I didn't realize out. it was like uh, online. Like <laughs> this is gonna sound really dumb. So, like, I loaded into the game because I got it mm. free, I think, or it was like a trial or something. I don't know. I can't remember. Yeah. And I started playing it, and I thought it was like, it was like a single player at the start or something, and then you got to go into like. The yeah, there's nothing that feels multiplayerish at the start, right? Yeah, exactly. So yeah. I just started playing it, and then fuck, 
then like some people just came and like started attacking me and stuff. I was like, what, <laughs> what is going on? I think, look, the concept in and of itself wasn't bad if it came out in parallel with a single player game. It's just, I think Fallout has such a big fan base and it's always been a single player experience that people just didn't take well to the whole thing. Well, it was very buggy at the start as well. Yeah, but I mean, they were more critical than they would have been. Yeah, I agree, probably but then you combine it with a game that's a bit broken up, on launch, you know? Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's a bad combo. It was so broken on launch that the Australian Competition and Consumer Commission allowed yeah, digital yeah. refunds. Yeah, I remember that. Like, that's pretty aggressive. Whoa, brand new map from Among Us. Whoa, oh, holy winner. moly, saving the best for last. Yeah, best... What was it? Rated? Best we, new best map. Best multiplayer game. Best multiplayer game. So Whoa, this looks crazy Among Us. Let's cross it together. This is a cool new map. I take it back. I actually want to yeah. play the game now. I mean, it's got shooting now. Wait, I, hang I'm, on. How many players can you have in it? I thought you could only have like eight players. There was more than eight players. I think, I think you can have a hundred now. A hundred players in Among yeah. Us. Wow. Okay, cool. And it's, it's be become cool. a looter shooter now. Oh. Much better. Look at this. Wow, look at the graphics. They've improved a bit. They've improved it a lot since From part one to... that I played, what, a I, month ago? I think this ago. might be 3D. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Could just be a really well shaded 2D. Oh, they've done ray tracing on the 2D. I get it now. I get it. Did the original have guns? I don't remember the original having guns. Nah, just knives to stab people. Mm. Stab them in the back. They've had a lot in this. Big update. Right, Do you reckon this is a free update? Maybe you have to pay a dollar for it. No, I reckon this is part two. They're going to announce it as... Among Us 2. Among Us 2. Oh, Go beyond Among Us. us. You know we're up, meant to be up to like Destiny 5 by now or something like that? <laughs> <laughs> you know that was their, announce yeah, their can... announced schedule? Dude, you know what's really weird? The other day I was trying to remember what Destiny 1 looked like and yeah. where you start off in the- and I swear to god I can't. My mind has like mixed in number 2 that I can't even remember how Destiny 1 started or what the game was like uh, even though I played it to death. That's crazy. It's, it's so weird, dude. You guys were addicted to it, weren't you? We were, yeah, I'd say addicted. I'd say, yeah, it was a problem. Absolutely. I don't really play those games. It's just playing the same game over and over again. Yeah, you don't. I mean, Animal Crossing isn't your kind of thing. I don't play Animal Crossing. Really? Bullshit. I saw you the other night on it when I had my Switch on. That wasn't me. That was, that oh, was my yeah. wife. Oh, yeah. What? She was playing my program. Seriously? <laughs> she plays my profile, she plays her profile, and then she has hey, another profile on her By the way, Switch. what is this? This is a VR Star Wars game. That's massive. Yeah, they've already had a bunch. No, they've already had a bunch of VR Star Wars games. Oh. There's another one. This could be good, though. They had a uh, Vader Immortal, I think it was called. Okay. Wait, I feel like I'm just saying Immortal because I've said Immortal. How do you feel about... Now. See, like, I actually get way more interested and excited when hey, I see wait, a new wait, IP. Is Super Metroid HD? No. Uh, Hyrule Warriors, yeah. This I is get more excited if KK. I see a new IP than I do something like Star Wars and it's like yet another game in the Star Wars universe. What do you mean? With the same characters. I'm like, I'm over the whole repetition of the same characters trying the to Star be merged Wars. into a story. Yeah, I'm like... Yeah, but have you seen The Mandalorian? Yes. Oh, you don't that like was it. That was probably the only recent thing that I, I felt really was different it. enough that yeah. it, was, it was good to, and enjoyable to watch. Yeah, but I have to admit, I wasn't the biggest fan of that one either. Yeah, like... I, the story really didn't really feel like it was going anywhere. But you have to watch it, though. I did. I watched the entire first season. I'm like, where is this going? It doesn't feel like it's really... The journey that they're undertaking doesn't really seem to go anywhere. No, that's fair enough. Look, I think, like, it's kind of meant to be a bit like that in terms of the way that they've set that that uh, show up. It's meant to be like a, 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 you know, Wild West shooter every week, in a way, you know? I guess, but I feel like with, with say, on the Wild West topic, if you look at something like Westworld, it feels like everything is going towards a particular story goal. goal. Yeah. Whereas with this, it just feels like it's not really... They're just writing it as they go. Maybe. 
I feel like they lost their way though in Westworld. I, I gave up. They, after, I think they have a little bit too. Half of yeah. the first episode one of season three. Oh, okay, I'm, like, I'm not up to season three yet actually. So I, got, don't say I, read, I watched half of it and I'm like, I'm over this show. Damn, and then I checked okay. the reviews for it. I'm like, maybe it's just me. And then the what reviews are pretty bad for the season. The problem so, like, is the first season was so good. Oh, the way things get tied up that it's so hard season. to just. First season is mwah. So yeah, good. it's love it. Perfect. It's really, yeah, it's really good. Sick. The first season. It's, such it's good so show. hard to to go anywhere from and that. I was okay with the second season, but I was worried about it. And mm -hmm. then yeah, the third season, man, it sucked. Do you man, know Abe's Odyssey, man. I love Abe's Odyssey. Yeah, I remember it back in the day, huh, man? I always forget the name of the guy who made it Lawn or something memorable like that. Games. He's like a really interesting guy. He wanted it to be like some kind of like seven part thing. It's like really crazy. Yeah. It's like a full on, like, if you, you should, you should Google the story treatment for Abe's Odyssey. Okay. Like, he's mapped it all out. It's really crazy. Oh. It's like, really thought about it. It's like, basically, he's like Jesus or something. <laughs> it's really crazy. But I've got a soft spot for these games. Yeah, same. And a I spot. remember the, the first one when it came out. Such a cool game. Yeah, oh yeah. I was addicted to it. I had it on my PC. Next award. She's a host and producer from IGN and your host for the Game Awards pre-show. This is Sydney Goodman. It's an awkward transition. Mobile games were once defined by their limitations. This is going to be Genshin Impact. The games that the excelled <laughs> despite their platform. Man, how, how elevated are mobile games that it's like no in the last half the hour of the show? It's mm. not it's never well, been speaks the last half hour, but I think it's still longer. Where the nominees for best watch. mobile game have found massive audiences because of their platform. What do you reckon is going to win? Best mobile game Among Us. Presented by LG Wing and uh, like Snapdragon. I think it's between Genshin and Among Us. Mm. I think they'll give it to Genshin. So if we had to vote, big week in gaming, what would you submit it for? Best mobile game? Oh, I'd, yeah. I'd go Among Us. Oh, really? I, I'd say Genshin Impact. I guess when you But I have such limited up. knowledge of these games that I can't. Yeah, I, I wouldn't would be able to properly comment. Just wouldn't vote at all. I'd be making it up. Too. Among Us. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's probably had the biggest impact. <laughs> these people are so weird. I like how they got the Jeff Keighley uh, thing in the background really on the Among Us <laughs> We should have had something there. I should have put like his face on, um, on just a game. big wall. No, it looks really cool in the background that you got. So when's, when's your next video coming out? I was hoping to do some this week, but work has been crap. And this weekend I've got family stuff, so... Yeah, you gotta quit your job, dude. I do have to quit my job and do it full time, yes. I might actually do it next year. I might do that. Nah, you gotta uh, get more views. You gotta get more views before you quit. I gotta get more content before I do something silly like that. You have to grind. You have to grind in the. Gotta grind a man. Grind but you gotta take take one thing and just. What she said. If there's one thing that people, what she said. If there's one thing that people can learn from this entire thing is take one thing, doesn't matter what it is, and just focus on it. Like a maniac. Congratulations to Among Us. So what's the one thing you need to focus on? Next up, the Monster Hunter franchise is coming to Nintendo Switch in 2021. This I'm, is I think I'm going to get this game, Monster dude. Hunter Rise. Monster Hunter? Yeah, Monster Hunter Rise. I, I see, I'm, I played... I might get this game. I played the other one with Swinney. World. And World, yeah, and I just couldn't... I think the problem is the scope is so big that unless you, you really want to invest time in it, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. you don't do it justice and you, yeah, it's not... Yeah, it's definitely a time sink. That's it's a sure. huge time sink. I just think it looks really cool, it looks fun. Hey, they, this could be a Switch Pro announcement. <laughs> sure. No, dude, I reckon they'll have a Switch Pro at around the same time that this game comes out. You reckon? They did it with the like something similar with the 3DS. I definitely this, would go for a Switch Pro. This, this game needs more power, man. Like, behind it. The game or the console? 
I mean, the console needs more power. So yeah, the console know. absolutely needs more power. I like, mean, look, the, depending on the game, it's perfect. It's just that the certain games we're like, oh, we should have had that little bit of extra power there. Well, yeah, like, because I'm looking forward to playing Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Mm -hmm. That's a game that just came out, but it literally runs at like 23 frames a second. Yeah, yeah. And I feel There's like a few games only... like that on the Switch. Surely they'd only do that if they knew that the next one's coming out soon, you know? This is like, oh, Maybe. this is pretty bad, but let's just put it out there because we know the next console's coming out. Yeah. I've seen I've seen a bunch of, you know, right, games that were released the on the Switch that had pretty poor frame rates. And... Yeah, that's true. Think is going to win, and we'll find out a little bit. I mean, 30, I'm actually fine with locked 30. 30's fine. Lock 60, oh, right? Control runs at what I think is a lock 30 on Xbox One X and... One day, um, and it feels good. Room, like, it feels the, smooth enough. Uh, and asked me and mm. Ashley, By the way, Control, great. I'm not going to say anything about it, it but yeah, don't, don't, I highly don't recommend it. It's really, really fun really gameplay. I <laughs> Once I get through the games of some other year... Just hey, this, that's the voice of Joel, right? I don't, I don't know the characters. Yes, it is. Yeah. Games. But he's one of their characters, yeah. It's the voice of Joel, I'm pretty sure. Into Ellie and Joel. Space it is. and music became major elements of their story. Uh, he puts on an accent in the actual... This is Eddie Vedder. Yeah, it will be, for sure. Those moments, now He's got such a cool voice, this guy. Oh, I could listen to him Incorporated Neil's and fall asleep to that voice. Not as a writer, but as a father. Oh, just... It involved a song like, he would play and sing to his trouble. daughter every night. That song was Pearl Jam's Future Days. One day, Neil asked if I was comfortable playing it in a scene he was writing for The Last of Us Part Two. Now, I don't generally get nervous, but I understood what that song meant to Neil and to the game. And the truth is, Neil can play that song better than me. But nobody can play it better than the person that wrote it. From Seattle, performing Future Days, here's Eddie Vedder. Cool. If I ever were to lose you, I'd surely lose my Everything I have found dear, I'm not found by myself. Trying sometimes you'll succeed to make this man of me. He's got such a distinctive voice, eh? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's really cool. This is like his home setup because I've seen him uh, oh. in the exact same setup on, <laughs> uh, on uh, Howard Stern show. Have you have you watched Into the Wild? No. Dude, watch it. What's I it think on? he did the entire soundtrack for it. What's it on? Uh, I don't know if it's any of the on on the streaming services. <laughs> and then how do you watch it's, it? Oh, it's the film's been out for ages. Oh, it's one okay. of my favorite films. Yeah, based on a true story. I'm not going to spoil anything about it, but it's it's really worth watching yeah, the film. Spoilers. It's really cool. I like how he's got all the lights and LEDs and stuff like that in the background. He's That's pretty cool. But do, do me a f they're actually candles. Do me a favor and watch. No, 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 dude. There's no candle that looks like watch that Into the Wild pink. this week. Oh, dude, I got a lot on. Uh, come just watch it. Watch it. This is, this is worth watching. Look, yeah, you said sorry. <laughs> I've never seen a candle do that. No, no, they're not <laughs> candles, obviously. But the one, the way, well, hang on. The one that was all the way to the right somewhere, that looked like a candle. <laughs> yeah, there was candles. Yeah. That was so funny. He, he's mixed it up a bit. Either that, that it's funny. one of those LED candles that looks like a candle, but isn't a candle, but that looks like a legit candle. Yeah, I don't think that would be an actual candle. No, that's a proper candle. Nah, that looks like an LED. It's way nah, too that's perfect. a candle. It's flickering. We need to somehow settle this debate. We need to get in touch with this guy. Look, and I actually, ask him, did he use a real I'll, candle I'll or not? I'll switch because it's a some candle. Of them, real, some look, of them they're real candles because some, some are brighter, some aren't. Yeah, some are out as well. So that's yeah, some are like good almost size. completely dead. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, maybe. But the LEDs. I was talking about the other LEDs. Man, people are gonna wish they could mute us at this moment so they could listen to the song. Just watch the bloody song. Like, don't watch us if you want. That's true. You don't want to watch this song. Well, because then yeah, they're watching yeah. a. a, a a song through a video that was pre-recorded through another video <laughs> uploaded again. But also, you know what? Just buy the game and play it because the this song is in the game. <laughs> oh really? Spoilers. Spoilers! Oh look out! There's Where a guitar else? in the game. <laughs> there isn't. You can play it. You can actually what? play the guitar. That is actually a spoiler. Really? I thought no. I linked you to videos of stuff where you can play no, the I guitar. I just ignore what you send me though. 
Okay, fair enough. <laughs> yeah, there's um, a guitar in the game you can play. By the way, talking over it, it becomes transformative. So it helps transformative. us with our, okay, it helps fair us with our yeah. fair use of it. What are we transforming exactly? Our commentary about Yeah, we're better transforming into a worse experience for people than it originally was. <laughs> hey, transformative has nothing to do with if it's better or worse. I guess that's true. And it most certainly is worse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, most certainly it's worse, yeah. I like that setup, dude. Like, this setup with you and I, it looks good. Like, I've got all the gamer shit. And, and I've got, got the, the minimalist, minimalist PS5. Shit. And you're almost yeah. a big F you to everyone in the audience. I hey, don't. I should like, take this off. <laughs> I've got a PS5 that's just window dressing. I don't even play it. Right, so that was... <laughs> oh, you know what I wait, should wait, listen put to on? Him, listen to him. Yeah, I am. I am. That song that you might recognize from, from The Last of Us. And <laughs> I just like forgot the name of the game. I appreciate the way that was, that was used. Um, especially bringing Joel and Ellie together, uh, connecting through music, and I, and I thought maybe it was cool too that made you. Hey, what are you doing? Well, there's a lot of noise. Perhaps pick up a guitar oh. yourself and, and, and write a song for but you. But I can't. Um, can't connect it anyway. But, uh, no, I like the way you've got to set it up now. Nice it's good to be part of this. Uh, you have, like, appreciation uh, and be part of this. Like <laughs> you got too much stuff going on now. It's not minimalist anymore. Tell a story. It's just getting better and better all the time. Sorry. Uh, I have to say, his LED setup is so goofy. Uh, thanks for that. <laughs> he's like being so sincere, sincere and stern and serious. Yeah. And he's got these, the oh, man, I really want to put so some cool much. LEDs in. I got these from the Home Depot. Right, oh, no, no. He's like, I went on Amazon and it was, the, it was on sale. It's going to be delivered, I think. One of those drones. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Next day, yeah, it's a ordered one. So this game, well, what's the game called again? This is Red Dead Online, right? Yes. No, it's not. What is this though? This looks interesting. So, what have been the biggest announcements today? Oh, this, this is, is like Red Ben Helsing or something. Or something. I'm I don't know, I'm so tired I even forgot what was announced. <laughs> I know, yeah. I don't think there's anything that big, like... So Smash was exciting for me. Uh, you don't think that... Evil uh, Dead game, but that's not like, you know... Project... I'm not gonna watch it for three and a half hours for Evil Dead the game. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know, you were pretty excited by that, and you were you were also very excited by Perfect... Was it Perfect Dark? Perfect what's the, Dark, what's the yeah, I was about? just surprised about that, Joanna Dark. This is Van Helsing, right? I don't know, man. I still reckon it's uh, Red Dead Redemption. Okay. <laughs> Do I get an extra point? Evil West. Evil West. This is whole new. A new IP. Interesting. Oh, okay. you, new IP. How did, like... As a game designer, I'm not a game designer, but as a game designer, obviously you must. <laughs> Wait, can I just pause you? It sounds yeah. like you are saying you're a game designer. No, no, I'm not a game designer. <laughs> but as a game, game designer, designer, as a game designer, what does a game designer do? Do they like, do they start the process with this amazing idea that they dreamt of, or do they get a board and go, okay, what genres haven't been done? We've got zombies and we have the West. Wow. Well, I think it depends, man. I think smart people look at the resources that they have. We've also got and leverage what they have rather than, right right, you know, if we, we, if we make really good shooters, don't go off in a bizarro a category, right? I guess, but why wouldn't you push yourself to do something different? But I mean, I'm talking about, say, say someone does shooters, but then they go, okay, what's the next genre of a shooter we can do? Or like the, the storyline. Oh, okay, let's take dinosaurs and mix them with space. Yeah, but that's a game designer, right? What is this? This looks really cool. You know one game that got really good reviews, I think, is um, Astral Chain on the Switch. Yeah, I got it. I got it too, and I just I got relatively far into it, but I just um I wasn't digging it. I, I, I don't know why. Look, you know that I'm like the resident Nintendo fan on the podcast. Mm -hmm. I, I do think there is a there is a factor of if a game comes out on the Switch that does something that it doesn't usually do on the Switch. It gets way more love than it really should. I think I feel like so, Astral yeah. Chain came out on PS5 before. People would be like, yeah, whatever. Yeah. I feel like that might be the case. I mean, look, it's a, it's a good game in many ways. It just, there's something about it I just couldn't really... I don't know, it just didn't click. 
Yeah. I, look, I know, again, you know, I know we keep saying it all night, but like the games are so good, and there's so many games. Like if you're not a ten out of ten, you can have a nine out of ten that just doesn't vibe with you. you just, and I think something in the back of your head is just like, you know, but what? I think different all people have different. What's out of a ten, right? I mean, to me, it's not a nine or a ten out of ten game personally. As a general consensus, it might be. It's just for some reason it just didn't click. Mm. Oh, it's a pretty highly rated game. I think it's like eighty-five on Metacritic or Xbox. something like that. Mm. I mean, that's from memory. Play it on the only Xbox that you can't get your hands on. For me, I am Ooh, often hot take. I look at the Ooh. status of where we are in terms of depression and cool anxiety park, and inattention. We owe it to all the people that are to be really creative. I, I and to try missed the start of it. First hear it wow, this guy's crazy, Like buff, a video man. game is medicine. My name is Adam Ghazali. I am a neuroscientist oh, and a neurologist. Okay. Interesting. It started for it me like 12 Sanford. years ago. I became really interested in this idea of creating experiences as a way of improving brain function. And this relies on a principle called neuroplasticity. The fact that our brain reshapes oh, it's itself like brain and training. modifies itself in mm. response to challenges. I think so it's a brain training game? For me to create yeah, for a PS5. video game that was carefully designed to challenge and reward the brain in a very specific way. And so what just happened a couple of months ago, the FDA cleared Endeavor RX as a medical device to treat inattention what? in children uh -huh. that have ADHD. This is the first time ever that the FDA has cleared a video game for any medical condition. So what we're talking about right now is to have a video game prescribed just this guy looks like pills for conditions. And he looks like an NPC. This is a new type of <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean by that? He looks like so distinct. Yeah. Like he's got his hair. Yeah. It's I know. White, and then he's got like the gray he's mustache. Got character. Just the mustache. Yeah. He's yeah. so distinct. It's like very distinct. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. It's like you and I look like so many other people. Yeah, like Dave Grohl. Yeah, exactly. What's this game? Do whatever it takes to neutralize the threat. Is it real time shooting or is it? Bring the thunder. Oh, okay. As gamers, you are just generally better humans, and the world needs you. This is Portal Here 3. At the peak humanity procreation facility, Omen. Gamers from around the Wait, this is Omen. We're on, we're on, we're the Omen boys, aren't we? Yeah, we are the Omen boys. That's right. Oh, we love guys. Omen. Woo! I will donate oh, my donate kidney my if you guys Omen. send me an Omen laptop. I love that ad. It's talking down to gamers. It's great. That's beautiful. Transcend, transcend humanity. humanity. <laughs> Hit me up, Omen. I Hit me up. I will humanity. transcend the hell out of humanity if you send me a laptop. <laughs> I want to transcend everything. I will be... Transcendus Prime. Hey, is this... is this... the new FIFA? <laughs> yeah, it's really weird the way it all works, how it's like, you get 10 hours of FIFA or something. Huh? It's That's like part trial. of EA. EA play. That's brilliant though when you think about it, because it's all you need to get hooked. Anyone yeah, who definitely. reaches the 10 hour mark, they're hooked. Yeah, I agree. They're gonna get the game. Oh, yeah. Yeah, shit. Yeah, definitely. So, is this an announcement for more titles coming to... Hey, did you see, you know, with The Sims? Someone worked it out. Doesn't it cost, like, $1,800 US or oh, something yeah, yeah, to yeah, yeah. get all the... the DLCs for it? No, it's, not, it's like 18000 or 36000 or something. What? Like, that much? Can't be that much, yeah, surely. No, it is. Now, what? Console, Steam, and I'm almost Star certain. Wars, it's like Jedi tens of thousands. I didn't think they had that many of them. All right, now on to one of the biggest games this year. It was created by three developers in Seattle. Now four. You saw them. They've won two Hades? awards tonight. Oh, no, they this. absolutely took over the internet with Among Must Us. Be. Well, they sent us something special. This is the reveal of the brand new map for Among Us. Check it out, crewmates. And the crowd yeah, goes not, mild. Not, not say anything, Mike, but you know, we'll give you some awards. You give us a map. We'll have a, give us some juicy maps. It sounds like a pretty good trade-off, if you ask me. Wait, so this, this game was only made by like three people. Jeez. Does it look like it was made by more people than that? <laughs> oh. <I f> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. 
Hey, hey, it's the not about shape. the way it about looks. It's not about the way it looks. At this stage, it feels like they just have a license to print money, basically. I feel, I feel like all the twi Twitch streamers are looking at this right now. Oh, yeah, something different, finally. Yeah. I'm playing this eight hours a day. Oh, it's a gap room. Oh, records. Never had records before. Swinny would be so annoyed because he loves this game. Yeah, but I, I don't think he loves it enough to really care. We definitely have an imposter here. <laughs> Wait, you can be a ghost now? The airship. Cost $59.99. Is this going to be for free? You reckon if you already have I don't, the game, actually, what's I the don't model? Know. I wonder, I wonder. Hmm. It's a well-priced game. Oh, here we go. Switch into a mask, and that drops right now on Twitch for the next thirty minutes. That's right, the Jeff Keighley mask. Have fun. Don't be sus. They they came to me and said, "All right, we can do this." Wasn't my request. Anyway. Wait, uh, so it's a mask for Twitch? How does that? I don't know. Now available. All right. Oh, so that, that, like you know how I said before that the mask on the Among Us guy that was the reference, views. right? He's joining us now live from the UK. Ah, oh, yeah, I guess that was the reference. Hello, Jack. I, oh, I don't. Jack. I guess I'm not on Twitch, so I don't get Hello, what he Jeff. just said. How's it going? Hello, everyone at the Game Awards. Oh, if you play Hi. Among Us, you can so have a Jeff Keighley mask. From our family and friends, I thought it was a mask on Twitch. Lights. Get his lights like that. You, you are the basic bitch yeah, version. How do I get his lights like that? <laughs> oh, he's got, hang on, hang on, wait, I can get purple. Hang on. You've how got do like I do one this? Light. You've got one light and he's got like a fuck. He's got no, like wait, a I can do this, man. I can do this. I can do this. I just gotta know what. Oh, here we go. I think Alana Pierce will win this. Oh yeah, that looks pretty good actually. I there think that's go. better, dude. And yeah, then... leave it like that. Leave it like that. That looks better. All right, let's the... re let's let's go back to the start and re-record this. <laughs> okay. Wait, hold on. Wait. Oh, that's too much. Oh, that's too much. Oh yeah, no, they look pretty good though. Over, over oh, wait, let me get the. Let me get the. Okay, is that one? No. Oh, that one. That's the one that I want. Okay. Can I make that? Who do you reckon is going to win this and amazing category? To... No idea. Valkyrie, congratulations! Wow, Valkyrie! Valkyrie. So much congratulations, Valkyrie. Yeah, look at her lighting setup. Whoa, geez, that looks pro. Of my friends, how did you do this? And fans and my loving community. Wait, who's this? Sorry, so Valkyrie. Me, uh, Who's Valkyrie? Seven or so years Content of creator. Streaming and now content creator, to, uh, right. Seven years of streaming. And she's still banging on the desk. Follow this some content so creators. Amazing. But unfortunately, I'm not hot enough. I don't know. It's just unbelievable. Anyways, thank you so much for this. Do you think this is a good I'm advertisement for a stream right now? To accept this award. Well, um, yeah, yeah, obviously. <laughs> She's gonna get a ton more stream, stream, stream there. You gonna watch her? No, I don't watch content creators. Why, you don't like to watch people play games? Uh, no. <laughs> I feel like you're so triggered by Twitch. No, I'm not, I'm not. I just, I I don't get, I, I get that other people watch it. Totally cool. Let's be real, you don't get it. I just don't do it myself. Donald and like, you know, we're talking about sports and you don't understand people who Fortnite watch sports. No, no, I under that's the thing. I get it. Oh, it's like so saying, I don't get why people smoke. I get exactly why people smoke. Mm. Uh, uh, so, yeah, I was so excited right now. Uh, new season has started. We just all battled Galactus together with our favorite Marvel heroes. And, and what that's done is it's left the Fortnite zero. Also, yeah, they reckon there's another Hunter that will get revealed. So they've always, already had Kratos. For uh, Fortnite. Could be Master Chief. From Fortnite. And, for Fortnite. Uh, okay. Could be Fortnite Samus or Ran for Metroid. This is such a boring part of this right this whole now. thing for me. <laughs> I'm just completely switched off. You love off. Fortnite. Fortnite's not that bad, actually, to be honest. No, I've just switched off. I couldn't care less about any of these games. <laughs> or streaming or online content creators or whatever. I'm just going to play with my lights until then. Tell me when Here this Here we go. What is it? Over. Oh, it's Master Chief. <laughs> in Fortnite. You you guessed the character, you just got the wrong game. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> yeah, Kratos and Master Chief just joined Fortnite. Funny if the, Fortnite. they announced Kratos in like Animal Crossing or something. <laughs> That'd be awesome. <laughs>
Isn't awesome. that crazy? Like, oh, it's absolutely crazy. I can't believe it. Oh my god. Oh my god, Master <laughs> Chef. Master Chef is in Fortnite. <laughs> Master Chef. Ever growing cast of characters in Fortnite. And the coolest thing is he's going to be available tonight. Uh, Tonight, you can go and, and hey, no get way! It's like it's like how do I get twenty this bucks? Game. It's like twenty bucks. How do I get this game, dude? Did you hear me? Yeah, yes. So what? It's like twenty bucks uh, for the skin. What's twenty bucks? Like right I don't care. I'll get it. How much does it cost? I want it now. I think it's like twenty. I think it's twenty for the character for the whole game. Okay, this is a cool trailer though. You have to admit. Okay, I'll, I'll watch this. Is this red versus blue? Yeah, it's using the machine my star. Fortnite. what now? It's only one of the most popular video games in the world, but more obviously, it's where we are right now. Huh. Wait a minute, if you had no idea that we're in Fortnite, then why do you have a cardboard cut out of Master Chief? Perfectly regular reasons. Whoa, you guys new around here? No! The Chief got eliminated by a sneaky blue! That's no blue! That's... that's Ninja! It's such an honor. Oh, I'm a huge fan of yours on Twitch. Twitch You're like, is this is like heaven for you. <laughs> oh man, I'm like playing with myself right now out of excitement. You're rising. Yeah. What are you doing here? You got that cyberpunk uh, slider all the way to the right. Oh, you're talking about this? Oh, what the? Yeah. I should have just worn the bloody hat on my actual head. Pretty sure it was called <laughs> the else. The Either way, you can start reliving your favorite Halo memories here in Fortnite, and maybe add your own personal touches to the map. Hey, wait! Does that mean we can have dance battles? He, to be fair, he was a huge Halo say? player back in the day. Ninja. Who? Uh, Ninja. He was a competitive one. He was good. Well, I liked Halo back in the day. Remember? Yeah, Halo's good. Red versus right. blue, Donald. I'm also being sarcastic. Yeah, isn't that so I know. awesome? It's so funny. And I'm looking so forward to Halo awesome Infinite, though. You've got Game Pass, right? Yeah, look, I think I'll play it. I'll but play you, it. Well, I'm not, why wouldn't you? It's going to be free. It's, it's, awesome. it's out there now. I'm not a huge Halo fan, but I, I I'm interested to see like how this it. one is going to come out. <laughs> like, just thinking about you, I think actually there's a chance you'll you really, really like Halo. Like the way that I don't think so. Works. I tried almost every single one of the games oh, have you? and oh, okay. could not get it. into any of them. <laughs> I just don't like the lore. It's it's and those but aliens I mean, that sound you like the multiplayer. You might play the multiplayer. Yeah, but the multiplayer is not the alien. Multiplayer, I'd probably enjoy. Yeah. Have you played any of the multiplayers? A little bit. Oh, okay. You do. In, but not enough, I think, to really give it the proper justice that it deserves. If that makes sense. But enough to go. It's not really my thing. Are we still on Fortnite? Oh my god. Yes, we're still on Fortnite. It's so exciting. So what? We got the, Are they announcing the zombies people? or something now? I, 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 to be honest, I wouldn't even know if they're in it or not before. Thanks, Donald. I have no idea where we're going next, but I'm on board. More. Thanks, Jeff. All right, uh, Donald Mustard from Epic Games. All right, <sighs> coming up in a moment, Keanu Reeves is going to present the award for best game direction. We've still got a few more surprises. <laughs> Cyberpunk. Don't go anywhere. Right now, let's hear from Rocket League on their new season. Apparently, Rocket League. Minor spoiler alert. <laughs> People are saying that hey, he's wait, wait, probably going to be worse. Rocket League's vibrant community in such a big way. <laughs> Is this <laughs> one of the devs? Don't know. Don't think so. That's a cool setup in that house. Holy Starting moly, I want that. Why did he have an iPad in front of How many records do you have? It's sick. I know. All weekend long. Let's check I've got a record playing a bunch of records and then I just realized it's... Brand new trap, but I made shit. It for you guys, and I call it <laughs> what are you talking about? I have a record player and a whole yeah. bunch of records, and then I just realized probably about sixty or seventy, wow, and then I just lot, yeah. I just realized it's just what am I doing? <laughs> you know what I like about a record player and playing records? What? It's like an experience. You know, you see. Yeah, it's down, a shit experience. It, it sounds way worse than anything I have. Uh, I don't mind the I don't mind the experience of putting it on and then the experience of having player? to get up and put another one on. Oh, it's it's just the Sony whatever, but uh, okay. Like it's not the worst. It's not one of those little cheapo things you find at JB Hi-Fi or something. But yeah. it's just I don't know, like I feel like it's just an a, 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 a It's one of the most gimmicky things I've done. So it's so weird because like I grew up listening to records. Yeah, so have I. And there is like something special about the dedication of like the nostalgia, down maybe flipping it. Da, da, da. No, I think it's the experience of sitting down and enjoying it. 
It's yeah, but like, you can you sit know, down yeah. and enjoy a normal. You no, know, you put an album on Spotify and you're on your system. Rituals, rituals are important, right? So it's like yeah, going to the cinema, it's like with friends, you do this. Yeah, that. yeah that's true. There's something, there's there's something that about it. is and more than just the sole experience of listening yeah, to the sound. Yeah, and I think that's yeah. the thing about it for, um, for, yeah, for having a record player. Now, having said all of that, I don't have a record player. <laughs> I've got records, but, I don't but have not a record. Why would you have records if you don't have a rec record player? What do you do with those records? I know I love music. Look at them. Oh, there's pretty cool artwork. To be honest, if you I guess. Buy, buy artwork, it's like I have. just got... expensive. There's a record. I've got. Um... I'm trying to remember which ones I have. What are you speaking of, I wonder if I can plug this baby in. I totally forgot I even had this. Should we put this in the background? Is an Xbox Series X that you're not playing as well? <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that. <laughs> Maybe you're a riot. Totally unboxed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've had it since launch and kind of just been sitting there. Do you regret getting the PS5? No. Not at all. Because I know I'll use it a lot. Oh, it does work. Okay. I should have put this in the background as well. Oh my god. That doesn't look good, dude. Nah, it looks shit. Because, no, I'm saying because of the aesthetic you've gone for. Yeah, you're right. And then you got that. That's just, yeah, it's so clashy. I should just go either full on minimalist or. Yeah. Nothing. No, I like the style. Like, I even the cool. hat probably doesn't really fit. <laughs> no, the hat the... definitely doesn't fit. I should take the, the whole. Uh... I mean, this is, you know, this being my first foray I think, into... I think it would look better if you had nothing. Just the PS5 to the side. Yeah, of course, but then the microphone then get, won't be able to hear me, so... Get, no, no, you, I've got my microphone underneath me. Underneath you? Yeah. As long and as it still works okay? your mouse, it'd be fine. Oh, fair enough. Your mouth. I'm getting tired. Just mouse, that. I said. Um, just yeah, I think if you had that in the side, and then you just need a little tree, Rupert like a little bonsai tree or something. Can officially declare another Rupert Watch. Team Go Rocket Grunts are also appearing in balloons and at Pokestops, and you can this save Shadow Pokemon Rupert Ghost from their villainous clutches. Make Rupert your buddy. Yeah, it's obviously a sponsored it, thing. Go snapshot and battle with it. I don't think it is. If you're sure, I reckon that's not sponsored. Watch, love Pokemon Go's Man, this December is so long. Day, happening this weekend. And be sure to check Twitter after the show to see how many Wooper oh, have been So did that come in the collector's Wooper edition? Watch. No, just got it separately. <laughs> That's so awesome. Uh, have you picked up the collector's edition yet? No, I don't even know where it's going. I think it's going to my parents because I ordered yeah, it so long ago. Yeah, you said it was and then you didn't want to go. Pick it up. Yeah, that's right. Sorry, Dad. It, have you seen how big it is? No. It, like, I saw someone's photo of it and then my wife said... Is that someone's back seat? What? <laughs> it, it like took up the whole back seat of the car. <laughs> really? Yeah. It's, it looks massive, dude. Damn. It, it looks like. Mm, I can imagine 40 it being centimeters big. wide, a forty centimeters deep. Really big. Yeah, that's kind of probably what I imagined it. Yeah, it looks like about 40, 40, 40. Just ballparking it. Ah. Okay, there we go. Totally screwed my hair. Cyberpunk. Aren't you glad that you didn't play Cyberpunk for three hours to watch this? <laughs> totally, yeah. <laughs> Especially this part. Actually, the just cause wasn't too bad, but... I like the evil dead thing. That was cool. This is Fallout, right? Yes. Update to 76. Oh, this is Fallout 76, yeah. Looks like, yeah. I can't. Are you supposed to keep these caps straight? I can't do straight caps. Depends what style you want to do. I don't do what it. What style do I, I want to do? It. Like, should, should I go tip. like this? Here we go. Here we go. What are they announcing? They're going to announce the two that I predicted. Steve. Haha. <laughs> nope. And then the record scratches and it goes, and Kratos and Master Chief. Okay, there we go. I'll go for that style. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, on the side like that? Game 
I don't know. Is it's all back. bad. We've got a lot also, it doesn't match the Keanu minimalist Reeves stuff in the back. No, this doesn't match. You need a man bar. You could have a minimalist thing in the back. I need a man bar. Okay, hang on. Destiny 2, so uh, make sure to check that yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going man right, button, exactly. For the next 30 minutes on Twitch, yeah. you can get a free cosmic wrap for Fortnite. There is a Twitch drop happening right now. So check that out. Twitch too. drop. This next game was announced God. last year right here at the Game Awards. Developed I feel so old when I hear things like that. Get on TikTok. I don't even know what it means. I swear to God, I don't even know what that means anymore. Get on TikTok for the Twitch drop. <laughs> the fuck does that even mean? <laughs> it's like talking in codes, I love it. <laughs> okay. Cutthroats. Spirits. Monsters. When you live in the water, you see mm. something. Is that you making those grunt noises or the game? <laughs> yeah, it is, sorry. Let's start okay. the party. Getting tired. The Queen of Bilgewater, looking to bring order to this twisted town. And stay down. They have uh, <clears throat> interesting physics in that. Fear. This oh, yeah? is destiny. The legend. This looks like torchlight. Yeah, yeah, it is. Kind yeah. of. But I've seen it different. Universe. Looks like Ever again. A dishonored swordsman fleeing from his past like the wind. How raspy is this guy's voice? Oh my God. Mm. Fox devours the essence of her victims. He smoked a few cigars in his life. I see no fortune standing in their way. We should have narrated this entire show talking like this. <laughs> My blade. Can't help but hey, that voice. What brought them together? I don't know. No, yeah. Nothing good, I reckon. A League of Legends? Ah, okay. oh, League of okay. Legends. Have you ever played League of Legends? If, like, so probably played, no. Actually played, yeah, for a little oh, yeah. while, but... Yeah, but not enough to justify saying I played it. How, how long did you play it for? Like, 30 minutes. No oh, okay. Please welcome <laughs> Doesn't it match go for 45? Reeves, Keanu? <laughs> you didn't like, even play the full thing. One. <laughs> hey! Hey! Yeah. Hey! Yeah. You, yeah. you took the head off at the wrong time. Woo! Put it back this on. Category recognizes the studio that yeah, can I? doesn't look a day older than Hey, it looks like buggy. Setting an even higher bar for the entire gaming industry. Over the past months, I've come to really appreciate like, Oh, you're bending it. Oh, no. The kids are going to hate you. I can't do straight hats, man. A special shout out to the folks and team at CD <sighs> Project Red in Poland. I look like a I trucker an now. experience playing Johnny Cyberpunk 2077. So apparently he, his voicing is kind of out of place, actually. Oh, really? Compared to the other voice actors, yeah. People reckon it's actually not that good. <laughs> That's awesome. Man, how much would he have been paid for that? Oh my god. Like, how much do you reckon? How much would he Man, I can't wait to play this. Oh, I don't know how much. A, a lot. To be sort of like one of the main characters in it, if not the main character. Like millions? I don't know if multiple millions. Good pay, pay and the pay game pay. award goes to. Well, it'd have been a lot of effort though. And Last of Us Part it. Two. It had a lot of scenes. Of stuff. Part Two. My God, how many awards have they got? I feel like this is watching like when Lord of the Rings was like we're coming out, you know. Thank hey, you you called it. You called it. I did they say. waited till the end. I did say. You knew this was coming. I mean, together, it always seems like sus. Man, <laughs> that they've like yeah. saved all the people. I know, like, right? They've even got the lady in the window. Before yeah, they exactly. The real and then like the last person on the We're last is Neil Druckmann. Such an amazing <laughs> team, cast, outsourcing partners, our partners at Sony. And he just has all of the awards around him. On, yeah, game, exactly. He already has the award and, and just pulls it up. Oh, thanks. thanks. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I like how fake the background is, how staged uh, it is. The Godfather, uh, Pearl Jam, <laughs> City of Thieves. <laughs> the game awards and to all our fans. Some abstract Cheers. art, plants.
more abstract art. Congratulations, Neil. Right, At least you can have this paperweight as a background. The yeah, that's, that's by good. Nolan. Oh, finally. And we'll also have a Christopher Nolan does game of the year. That's pretty sick. London Philharmonic Orchestra back okay. Philharmonic! Studios, uh, game of the year. I don't know who Philharmonic right is, but now, he's done a few things already. To evolve, and should we, uh, uh, should we just put an X on yet. all of our predictions? <laughs> or is there time for, for something? Is this the right place for the party? Can we post? Is there a hashtag? <laughs> I seriously can't believe GTA 5 is surviving from the PS3 to the PS5. Yep. <laughs> and it's big. It's still as big as ever, man. I know. It's quite it's worse the online component that obviously kept it going. Oh, yeah, yeah. I didn't understand a word of that. Lots of guards, high tech security. I need someone to rob it. You're obviously going to need a submarine. So, wait, how does the online work for GTA? Hmm? How does it work? Do I don't know. So, I haven't played GTA Online for. Actually, since probably the since the since the PS3 <laughs> slash, slash Xbox era. Um, when you got the PS4 and you were like, look at GTA 5 running on this, it's amazing. Yeah, the difference was huge. But uh, I don't think I ever played GTA Online oh, in that era. So I don't know what they added to it and stuff. Great game, though, in terms of playing with friends and stuff. What is this? Not sure. But she decided to impose upon her people civilization yeah i oh, did i was going to say civilization as well and it's in 1082 following the Civ seven death of the king that she was crowned empress of spain it's in fact to celebrate this event that uh, rock and roll was invented <laughs> in <1989, laughs> that was a cool transition yeah that was that was cool actually but i thought it was the male indies which had it was the math, and then it went to the... it went to her eye. Yeah, that's so cool. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense, though. This was followed by the great devastation. Oh, this entire thing doesn't make sense, but it's a really cool trailer. Before it is. The it's like Civ 6, the bridge constructor. It's either that or Anno <laughs> something something. I swear to God, if it's bridge constructor. Bridge constructor. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that really looked like her. Humankind? Ah, new IP. Humankind. It's very Civ looking. It's surely from the Civ 6 people, isn't it? Maybe not, I don't know. We've been having fun with Instagram's mm. Game of the Didn't Year catch. AR effects here. No, we haven't. Instagram effects. Those we don't effects care. Are still available, so the award keep goes to your Instagram to. Reels. And coming up, we'll find out who's getting a real-life Game Award trophy for Game of the Year. That was it? That was the last <laughs> What the hell was that? Oh, my God. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? Respawn. Okay. Okay. I was gonna yeah, say this VR. has got to be VR with those graphics. Well, yeah. <laughs> How bad things gotten? What the? German occupation has turned every neighbor into a possible enemy. <laughs> it's like VR is going through like PS2 era. <laughs> yeah, kind of like that. Oh, maybe a bit better than PS2, but yeah. PS3. I mean, it's understandable. Like, look at that, jeez. Given the tech. Hey, that I have is to say, though, but... some of the really good PS2 games. Oh, look at that. Come on. Are you sure you yeah. want to stay better than PS2? <laughs> yeah, maybe not, but I still think it would be pretty cool to play something like this. I don't know about like, even Skyrim games. on PSVR was a cool experience. Yeah. And that looked way worse than Skyrim on PC, obviously. But you, you were the biggest promoter of VR. Okay. I still am. Made. I still think That's it's going to be. But you never play it. It's going to be big. I don't, I don't have time. I don't have time. You just said I have, I have half of Alex and I've got an Oculus and I don't have time. You want to hear the rest of the story? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he, he probably thinks he's like being recorded for like some documentary. He oh, doesn't realize oh, it, it's a VR game from okay. Medal of Honor. She just got punched in the face. <laughs> Surprise his sister as your brother. <laughs> hey, it was Medal of Honor. Yeah, it was already announced, I think. Oh, okay. I missed that part. Like, I mean, a few days ago. 
Oh, okay. I'll give that or a Or maybe way maybe. early, I don't know. It's not my thing. Man, how many ads for Oculus have there been? A lot, I guess, and Facebook. I'll never get um, Oculus. Obviously, they, you know, sponsored this. They would have paid big money to be Welcome on this. Yeah, I think that would have been sponsored so for sure. <clears throat> Medal of Honor from Respawn. I'll never VR. get an Oculus. You have to have a it's Facebook right account. Now. What an incredible Correct. trailer and game. I can't Boo. wait to play that. Hopefully this weekend. All right. Uh, when the show ends, the games continue with the Game Awards. Do you need it, though, if you're only going to use it on PC? And stream them yeah. on using the Oculus now, link? No yeah, and they'll brick it if your Facebook profile phones. gets blocked. Jesus. <laughs> so people have hacked the Oculus because they can't use it. Wow. Oh, one, this is it. This is it. Super Metroid remake. <laughs> Kojima, come on, Kojima. A new VR game. A new Mass Effect game. Oh, what is this? This is juicy. Juicy. It looked like a butt. It looked like Samus. I'm sitting butt. up for this. I'm sitting up for this. Metroid Prime 4. I don't know what this is so far. Starfield? No idea. It's looking cool, whatever it is. It looks really cool so far. Good trailer. Good trailer, Any guys. Big thing. Whoever you are. Dreadnought. Could be a few things. It's not a new EVE Online thing, is it? Hmm. What was that ship? I don't know. It's very Mass Effect -y music. I have no clue what this is. Yes. Whoa, Mass Effect! <laughs> Sick! <laughs> Wait, unless this is call? Mass Effect, the... Uh, will continue, continue. nice. Ah, it's kind of an odd trailer, though. Exciting. Why? Like, why is it saying, will continue? Because people probably think the IP's Mass dead. Because <laughs> of but they already Casey Hudson leaving and... and... Um, very exciting. All right, well, to present our final award... Well, that's kind of annoying. Okay, that's, that's, that's the, the most exciting, time, exciting thing all night. I'm glad I waited. <laughs> all right, I'm going to kill all our predictions now. Yeah, I don't care about anything after that. Thanks, dude. I have questions about Mass Effect being continued. That's all I want to know. It'd be cool ask if Nolan. Will Nolan know? Will... I will open up a Twitter account continue. just to ask him. Dear Nolan. Thank you, Jeff. It's an honor. No, it's what actually going to be called Will Continue. For me, I've always been interested <laughs> in telling stories that, that immerse the audience. Uh, I like movies that, that unfold in unexpected ways and, and pull people into oh, the really? world. Oh, really? What do you tell from your movies? movies? I see a lot I love of his films. That kind of story I, no, I, I'm saying I love them. Yeah, I know. It's like obvious that he's intersect with more traditional storytelling methods it's uh how is last of us not gonna win this seriously yeah tonight all six <laughs> it'd be awesome I'd be shocked. Hey, it'd be I'd awesome if animal crossing wins <laughs> yeah exactly <laughs> and the winner is animal <laughs> crossing animal and then <laughs> nolan well maybe that's why they have on him because he's gonna do a surprise <laughs> twist <laughs> and the surprise <laughs> twist is it's not what we expect <laughs> he's like yeah he's like if you listen to the first Dude. letter of every <laughs> statement yeah, of every announcement. It spells out <laughs> Animal Crossing <laughs> is everything. And it's actually an anagram as well. And then if you play everything in reverse, you will watch <laughs> yeah, exactly. the shitty yeah, Fortnite yeah. trailers first <laughs> and have the good stuff to look forward to later. <laughs> if you if you overlay at a fifty percent opacity the Fortnite trailer with the Warframe <laughs> trailer. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you see his statement about WB? Uh, sorry, Warner Brothers? Uh, no, what was his statement? So Warner Brothers came out and said they're going to release all of their next year movies on mm -hmm. HBO Max simultaneously with the theatres. Right. And Nolan, who loves the theatre, he went nuts about it. He's like, this is BS. No one's consulted the filmmakers about it. It's disgusting. Huh. And he said, this is what he said, he goes, 
filmmakers at night fell asleep thinking, wow, I'm working for the best movie company in the world and woke up in the morning and realized they're making movies for the worst streaming company in the world. Wow. <laughs> Such a cool quote. <laughs> I'm like, did he actually say it like that? Yeah, he wow. said, he said, woke up with the fourth Burn. best or the worst or whatever it was. But it was like, damn. It's that savage. Is harsh. But true. Where's the Animal Crossing medley? I want to hear this. The music in this was really cool. Yeah, there's a lot of guitar, right? These are some, like, number one and number two are some of the most memorable games. No, oh, well, they're so highly regarded, eh? Hey? Just graphically, this game was nuts. And, hang on, that was, I played it on PS4. If they redid that in on PS5, oh, they, holy they do, moly. They 100% get a They will do it, of course the they will, yeah. I'll probably play it again, for sure. It's a shame there's no real decisions and branches and stuff in it, but it doesn't it, it matter. It feels like play. almost like 100% they'll release a dual pack version. Oh yeah, for sure. Games remastered. For sure. Oh yeah, I wonder There we this. go. Mm -hmm. It's like a happy game though. It's a very happy game, but it's just, it's shallow. I would describe it. Well, it's when shallow really... in the way that life is shallow. Huh? <laughs> you get up and do the same thing over and over again. It's like life, exactly. It's <laughs> a shallow as life shallow itself. Like life, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Maybe that's why I didn't like thing. it, because it became too much like life itself. It is, it's monotonous. It's, it's super doing monotonous. doing the same thing over and over again. Trying to get more amiibo. Yep. Trying to get get the nut. Should I just uh, put Last of Us Part Two as the winner? And I've hang on, hang guys. on, hang on, hang on. Let's let's just let's <laughs> let's see well, this, this is, through. This is, this is like We've an been here for three and a half here hours. Oh, here we go. Shh. <laughs> Shh. Miss Last it. of Us Part Two. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> so oh what? What? It. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> it was oh. so anticlimactic the way he said it. He just opens Last it. Last of Us Part Two. Last of Us Part Two. Again, Come on, Neil. You knew you got this one. With. Um, everyone at Naughty Dog, I, I can't wait to hug and high five and get drunk with each one of you. Uh, that's going to have to wait till next year. But I'm um, Muslim. I want to just thank every person who worked on this ambition game and within Naughty Dog and outside. Uh, shout out and to I'm all, straight. Um, Sony Partners again, Scott Rohde, Connie Booth, Herman, and I'm no Post, Sean Layden, Jim Ryan, your support and trust in us means the world. Um, and more than anything, and I know that I speak for the whole team when I say this, yeah. we'd like to thank our friends and family that stood by us and supported us throughout uh, us making this game. Stood by they us? Inspire us not only what, did they like? More oh, no, games, they killed um, someone? But to improve how we make games. On behalf of everyone at Naughty Dog, thank you. What's, what, what's their next game, actually? No, thank you for an awesome gaming experience. We don't know yet, do we? Dog. Game of the year. No. I mean, they're all, they're going to make part three, no doubt, but they must be doing something else in the meantime. So what, what's the biggest announcement for tonight, you reckon? Mass Effect. But it's, we already knew it was continuing. I didn't know. It. No, I didn't. I actually didn't think it would be. We spoke about it on the show. Huh? We spoke about it on, on the podcast. No, we didn't speak about the fact that they'll they'll continue the, yeah, they, the Mass they, Effect experience. <laughs> no, no, we talked about how they'll have the the the, the updated remake of it. No. When did we talk no, about that? They're going to make a new game. When? Or maybe you weren't on that show. I think nah, I probably wasn't on that show. Yeah, they already had I'm, an. I'm a new to the show. Remember? They already had a blog post about it. Hey, did any of your uh, did any of the views go up or more likely down since I joined? Oh yeah, the subscribers plummeted. I thought they would have. We had like 50 subscribers. Now we're down to two. Can you sponsor us, Cyberpunk? Yeah, it's CD Projekt Red. Camera. It's off camera. It's off camera. <laughs> when you're uh. doing that, can't see it. All right. Uh, so the final tally was I got half a point for the predictions. Well, how did you get half a point? Because I said Smash Brothers character. No, 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 it doesn't work like that. I said I Master said, Chief. I talked about and Smash Brothers. I got both of those things just the wrong game. No, no, nah, no. Nah. You still then, won even without and then that. And for the voting, I got seven. I think it was two. You four, would have won six, that anyway. Seven. And you guys got four. Four. I should, I should gamble on this, man. Like. 
You what should is gamble it? on it. Five different But I categories feel like you actually spent time thinking about this, unlike no, me. No, I didn't. Well, I reckon you did. I'm just smart. Well, there's that too, but <laughs> I think you actually did think about it properly. All right, well, we should sign off. We should. <laughs> Wait, Indeed, we're going to go for three and a half hours. in the morning. <laughs> I'm going to get killed. All right, well, that was, uh, that was quite fun. Uh, how do you sign off for a reaction, Mike? <laughs> take just, your top off. Take my shirt off. <laughs> they literally ban you from on. Twitch if you do that. Do they? <laughs> yeah. Even even as a dude, you know, if you're not trying anything. <laughs> yeah, correct, correct. Wow. <laughs> this isn't going on Twitch, right? It's, no, we've been live for the whole thing. But not on Twitch, right? <laughs> yeah, on Twitch. I mean, YouTube's fine, you know. No, on Twitch. Slightly we've been live. Oh, we've been live on Twitch the whole time. Hi. <laughs> All right, let's say bye. Awesome. All right, bye-bye. Thanks for See the night. See you for the podcast on Sunday. Ciao. Bye. bye.